Ah, that's my monster Tenshi. Ah. And sorry for the hold up. Here we are. Should be hopping on now. Okay. Um, just gotta do dailies and a couple requests. And things should be nice and good. Okay. Okay. Well, nothing to do, but hop on in. Oh, Hajime Mashchenshi, thank you for waiting for me. Today was just my ab workout day. It took a little longer than expected, but I'm all fresh now and no longer sweaty. How are you doing? Hajime Mashchenshi. Either way, let me. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I try to stay professional, but every now and then I slip up. Uh, in the end, once I get myself back on a better sleep schedule, things should hopefully all fix themselves, but fingers crossed. Let me just... okay. So in a little bit, I'll need to... You know what? You know what? May as well go and use up a little bit of resin right now and farm. A boss a bit. Alright. Team I use. Team I'd like to use here. Let's put in Trina, Xian Yun, Bennett, Gaming. Let's keep him up on field a little bit so that the stacks of his R5 serpent spine can go up. Take out Dirge of Capellia as fast as possible. That should be good. Alright. Alright. Except. He. Ran out of stamina, and also kind of got stuck. That's life. Come on, come on. Well, it's... It comes with time. It's really just a matter of... If you stick around for long enough and use your resin somewhat reliably, eventually your characters will get stronger. Simply a matter of time. You get more resources as you play more, so... The only thing that really makes a difference is just knowing how to build a character. And that's not crazy crazy. And it's something you want to time. So I, I assure you that eventually everything will work out in your favor. Come on, come on. And oh my goodness. Should this be? There we go. We got that down. Cool, cool, cool. Just grab this real quick. We go. Okay, cool. And did we get? Okay, we got three. So 46, 46 for leveled character. That should be nice and good. Okay. So then, in that case, let's run through my comms real quickly, and then I should probably get a little bit more, more uh, from running my bounties and bounties and requests, which I already need to do. That said. Definitely already, I've got enough more to upgrade the Zhao stuff, all the nine right now, so I may as well do that. And everything else will. Then it's about one million more, which I could get from Stardust if I really felt like it. For Bennett, Pyro Damage Bonus, Energy Recharge Sands, Crit Circlet of some kind. His healing's good enough that you don't really need to build for it specifically. And in terms of four-star weapon, you give him... If he really needs more energy even after that, or the team needs more energy, you can give him Favonius. But the best option for him four-star-wise is actually... Well, Ali Hunter's technically better, but that's Weapon Banner. It's Samira Craftable Sword. Oh. Yeah, Noblesse. Crit Circlet. ER or Attack Sands. Honestly, I prefer Energy Recharge, because his own personal damage is going to be negligible in almost all cases. Pyro Damage Goblet. And then Sapwood Blade. That's really all you need to know for Bennett. And the best way to get no blasts is, of course, strong boxes while farming some some other domain. I guess you could farm the no blast domain itself and throw most of your most of your bloodstained pieces into no blast strong box. 
But, frankly, you're better off farming a domain where you want both possible sets anyway. Hmm. Because the only thing I have any no bless any bloodstained pieces at all is because Xinyan is actually best off with two piece, two piece bloodstain and pale flame to get just more physical damage bonus. Because she can't use her skill often enough to actually benefit from pale flame's four piece. And bloodstain's four piece is just silly in general. But that's neither here nor there. Let's actually put on the real comm team. You know. You know, this is actually okay. This is actually okay. Come on, come on. Just like that, and... Wait, wait, you know what? We could actually just plunge over there, and that does it already. That's silly. Hmm. Wanted who? Oh, oh, you mean... Wait, Jin Yan or Jian Yun? As they are... Comically similar in terms of name. But. Okay, Zinyan. Zinyan's a lot of fun, I will say. She's not meta, and fundamentally kind of never can be meta. But. She's very unique in the sense that she's the only Claymore character who actually optimally uses her charge attacks. Because her optimal combo, especially at higher con levels, is. Well, at least a few constellation levels. I think it's... Let me check specifically what her... Con... Yeah. Ninglong's fun too. Let me see. Well, actually, even from start, I'm pretty sure that... Her optimal combo is... Two normals. The first two normals in her string of four. And then transitioning that into a charge attack until you run out of stamina. And that's just unique, because no other Claymore character actually uses their charge attacks. Which also means that Dioc is a completely useless A1 passive. Okay. I'm sure we'll get him eventually. We'll come back on banners at least. Come on, come on. Or M. Over there. And that out, that out, and how much more we got? Simple, simple, simple. Okay. That wind blade went around in a really weird direction. Hmm. Turning light show. It might rep depend on doing puzzles here in Matayuna to actually get some of the sigils unlocked. But this commission can be done in one second. See? <laughs> if you lock onto that sigil as soon as you activate the commission, just go and immediately grab it. It's the funniest thing. New <laughs> invocations, this one should be simple enough. I do find it funny and very, very sad that... Oh, I'll just send it to you right now. The spreadsheet I use. For character builds. Gives you a lot of really, really good information. Oh my goodness. Wanderer. Yeah, I named him Futen to contrast with Raiden. A lot of people name him Shinji. Because he gets in the robot. But here's the... Here's the spreadsheet. It's really, really useful. No problem at all. But yeah, this is also... Cutching mains is a good source of build information too. That said, they haven't been updated as often these days. But what I'd really say you should do is... Actually, no, I was going to say what's really sad is that... Ningguang has been so power crept that people haven't even bothered checking whether the new Navi artifact set from last version is better than something like Archaic Petra for Ningguang. And I would assume it would be, but I don't know for sure. 
Battle Schools, End Card Games, Tacky, on Racing on Horses. Oh my goodness. Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D. Card game turns into a battle. Nice spot for the setting. Time to fight. Hmm. So, okay. So teleporting is still faster. Hmm. Oh, and automatically paste over there. So I assume we're fighting those slimes. Hmm. Okay. Forward, and he's got a good amount of stacks. There we go. Okay. The slimes. Beat them in the way you think is most impressive in the card game novel. Most of the problems in my novel. Realistic tactics. What are you waiting here? Hmm. Okay. You can't really say anything right now. Alright. Hi. And that did it already. Kind of a waste of a burst. Posing air, eye catching indeed. Make sure enough for us, Gary, to draw a few more. Take these as a reward, a little duel. Okay. Alright then. Hmm. So I'm gonna wait a couple of days until all the challenges for this event are open. So I can do them all at once. If I'd scheduled for Monday, now that would be really easy. Increased elemental mastery. White and light. Wait. So why is Yula in this team if it's elemental mastery based? Well, whatever. Go and collect my rewards and yeah. Mm -hmm. But the nice thing with C6 Bennett is that you can run Gaming really well. Because, I think I've said this before, just doing what? Oh, the event? Yeah. I... For the sake of, for lack of a better term, documentary purposes, I do like doing it all at once. But if you want the Prima Gems as soon as possible, or just find it a good way to keep it fresh in your mind, there's no shame in Doing it bit by bit, frankly, it's the more natural one anyway. Let's just see what this week's bounties and requests are. Let me get a bit more battle pass, too. Enema Electro Res? Well, I don't have any. Electro Resin. Electro Characters in Fontaine at Punier. Okay. White Iron Chunks, Clockwork Mecha, and Armored Crabs. Alright, alright. It's gonna go over and light iron and penetration. By the way, we got all this over here. I think this would be a decent enough team to use. Just for the plunges, but actually actually no. Put the other one back in. Won't be all that much. And does okay. Hard retainer does have her burst right now. Yeah. This should work fine. I can vaporize all these plunges even with that. Here didn't really use. That didn't really make a difference because I need to ammo anyway, but never mind. Never mind. Come on, come on. And yep, see, we can vaporize every single one of these plunges. So good. Okay. Let's go back to the city. But yeah, as you see, if you use C6 Bennett with gumming. It means that you don't have to rely, even during bursts, on his E refreshing itself. You can just immediately go for another Pyro-infused plunge. It really, really takes him to the next level. Okay, Pyro res decreased. This should be good. Should work. Okay. You used to use my Linny team for Pyro. Frankly, I use... Weekly bounties and requests is an opportunity and excuse to use different teams in order to target the various weaknesses and avoid the resistances of the bounty targets. Oh, in terms of constellation levels? I did hear about that. But their weapons and artifacts are entirely unique and separate, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's not going to make much of a difference for the five stars for me, then. Okay, let's put out the arena now. And this should... Oh my goodness. Come on, come on. How much am I going to... Okay. Here we go. Oh. Uh, okay. And just like that. 
and plunge down, and we're already really, really strong. Oh my goodness. A lot of it is just John Newton being pretty broken to begin with. But... The sheer speed in which I was able to dispatch those enemies. And to be fair, this is... A team I've actually used for Abyss. Some of the other teams I've used for Bounties are... Teams that either I have not used for Abyss and don't plan to, or... Teams that did not do as well in Abyss. Okay, so this... Empower Numa. So I'll use Usir for this. So I could actually use that Vesley team on this little bounty real quick. Show that off. Hmm. Shouldn't take too long. Okay, okay. Let's put in a boy, and then Shenha, and Shangling, then Bennett. Okay. But with this, Shenha and Zhongling both need. She has Fab Lance, she does not have Fab Lance right now. Switch that out real quick. You know, I have two Fav Lances, both at R5 and level 90. And I still need to shuffle them around because so many characters want to use them. It is pretty silly that this team's energy needs are so high that it needs two Fav weapons. But that. That's life sometimes, I guess. Let's see if I can. Get rid of some power. And just like that. Okay. So we successfully did it. There we go. And. Come on, come on. And just. That out of the way. And. Oh, goodness. Punch, punch, punch. Punch. There we go. Good and strong. Not as outright ridiculous as. The other teams. And to be fair, the entire deal with. Oh, and they all got their energy all back, too. To be frank, a lot of it is because treasure hoarders give a pretty crazy amount of energy for how small and insignificant they are. One of the understated ways in which Mahoyo has increased game, dif game difficulty over time has been decreasing enemy particle drops, meaning that energy has become increasingly more of a thing that you have to recover entirely by yourself with your own team. Because Mighty Trolls are relatively weak enemies, but they drop two huge rainbow particles. And to be frank, just weaker enemies in general are easier to get energy back from because energy particles drop at certain energy enemy health thresholds. And the easier those thresholds are to hit, the easier it is to use them as sources of energy. But what's actually really funny to me is... Well, interesting is that... They've also very heavily decreased the number of chambers that are... Just huge mob fights. With lots and lots of enemies. Typically they try to stick to small AoE as in... Two or three enemies at most. Because we can get a lot. Morgana becomes... Incredibly OP. It trivializes pretty much anything and everything like that. Because Morgana's weakness at times is energy. Because you want to build as much Yam as possible on Venti. Because most of the damage is just coming from him and his swirls. To be fair, Ganyu con Ganyu contributes heavily too, but most of it really is just huge swirls. Especially since, when you've got lots of enemies, the swirl damage is only increasing, because every enemy is getting hit by one swirl for every other enemy. It's what they call quadratic scaling. Every time that you add one more enemy, the, da the total damage being dealt increases exponentially. Let's just see. It's kind of a throwaway team. Okay. Just show off my new Viet real quick. Should only take a couple of... No, this should work either way. Hmm. He's got his Sacrificial Jade buff. Well... Very specific... I've been playing this game for three years. And also, I'm not free to play. But... 
To be fair, it's just Welkin and Battle Pass, but still, that does make a pretty significant difference over time. But, the ones I'm still missing specifically are Klee, Nilu, and then... Four Inazumas, actually. It's Ayato, Ito, Kokomi, and Ayaka. And then I'm also missing Shivros and Kirara. They're... They are... Four stars. That's not really... Not really the issue. Okay, there we go. See? Simple. In that case, we should... Maybe we'll get back a little. Right, right, right. He doesn't have Fav on him right now, because I gave it back to Shangling temporarily. Wait, who is this over here? Who are you? Dipiros the painter. Oh, I guess he got added in when I rearranged some of the furniture, so to speak, with Salsa the painter. Cameras and paintbrushes, different tools, different purposes. Different purposes. Not a professional photographer, can't speak to its professional uses, artist. Reference materials can't replace a painting entirely. Opinions. So no intricate creations with convenience, no doubt. Making art limitations apparent. Beauty and spirits can't be directly seized from the natural world. I don't think I've talked to this guy before. Nature, beauty, the soul are two very different things. So now I just gotta fight those armored crabs real quick. Okay. Then we'll have finished all of the requests, commissions, and bounties, and I will go on and trivialize Abyss with my Zhao team. The funny thing is, is that I've said this before, but my Zhao team is actually a only about as good, maybe even somewhat inferior to my... There we go. Gaming plunge team. And to be fair, just anyone you can really vaporize punches with is good too. I should, I'll eventually probably try a Dewick Punch team, though I'd really need to increase his talents first, as I haven't gotten his talents level meaningfully at all. And most of the reason he's good on plunge is because his plunge multiplier at base is quite good. And if you don't have his normals leveled, well, that's kind of a moot point. And to be fair, a lot of it really is just any character with who's able to add Vaporize to Sean Yoon's existing plunge damage bonus is going to be doing good damage, no matter who they are. So essentially anyone who can either deal pyro damage or infuse their weapon with pyro damage to the point that a lot of people have actually been trying Pyro Zhao. But... Yeah. In that case, let's make sure everyone's weapons are correct. Because on one side, I'll be running Zhao Plunge. So, then, then, Purina has the right weapon, and my newly level 90 Farzan also has the right weapon. For the other side... Guess what kind of team this is going to be? We got Nahida. Okay, Sack Rags is good. That itself is kind of a clue. Official, correct Stringless. That's good. Then... Kazo with Sack. Good. And then... The funny part... We got... On Field the Eye with, with, with Widsith and Thundering Fury. This is going to be an On Field the Eye team. <laughs> See how it goes. Hmm. In that case, Blessing is just plunge damage increase, which will not help the Yai team at all, but... Yai and... Yai was, is on banner right now, so I'm trying to use her in Abyss. I try to use banner five stars to force myself to change up my team comps. Hmm. Vaporize? No one's really going to be getting that, though. Make sure I... Hmm. That case, just gotta make sure that. Gotta put Furina Zhao team on this half so that Furin is not whiffing against the Hydro enemies. This should be good. This should be good. Okay. 
Guy team first half. Kazu with the crowd control should also help, given that this is a relatively AoE situation. And Fischl. Yeah, well, a lot of it is. Once you can pretty reliably 36 star, it's nice to add additional challenge and additional factors to yourself, because if you're just using, at least for me, if I'm just using the same two teams every time, it gets a little bland. Which is why I haven't used Ride a National in a while, even though it's really, really good. Hajime Mastenshi, welcome, how are you doing? It's, you arrived just in time, it's time for Jalabis. That's just, right, Fiorina in first slot, and then Faruzan, Sean Yoon, and Xiao. Here we go. Just gonna get started. I don't imagine that this run will be all that difficult, because I've actually kind of tested it out before, but here we go. Here we go. Okay, one, two, three. How many people can I sweep up? Here we go. Works pretty well. And Nahida. Get that all around. Original stories. What does that mean in this case? And two, three. Oh, interesting. We're actually getting a couple of overloads. Well, hmm. come on. The one thing about this team, it's got no healing or hard defense whatsoever. So every bit of damage I take, unless I use, god forbid, the healing blessing, is going to be permanent. Oh, oh. She's telling you about her OCs. Original character, do not steal. Come on, okay. So here, and just... That. Who is going to... Oh, hello, hello. Oh, goodness, but I only got I killed, so I don't didn't actually get the rest. That's kind of crazy. Come on, come on. Oh my goodness. Were any of them entertaining, at least? Somehow I don't have a good feeling about that. More elemental burst. Oh my goodness, and she was talking about AOT and MHA. Oh my goodness. Okay. When you said little cousin, I imagine she'd be something like 11. I mean, she might be, but... I don't know. Oh my goodness. Not the Bakugo. though. Not the Bakugo. though. Okay. Come on, come on, and let's just strike down here. Okay, let's actually nice we can put them back on the field now, maybe. Come on, come on. Who can I well actually we can just aggravate pretty easily now. Oh my goodness. Hey, we actually I got that right then. Oh, let's just aggravate the rest of this down. Quit Sith and Ian is good. A bit of oh my goodness. That just reminds me. This is gonna get a bit cross. But one of my friends was dating briefly this guy who was really, really big into MHA, and eventually they broke up because it didn't work out for various reasons, and it turned out that without us really knowing, well, without uh, me knowing personally, or more that it had been hidden somewhat well, her entire deal was writing Baku, Deku, and Brag, and that was just basically a real hobby. And you know... Fair enough. But... Yeah. But it was... Really, the main thing was just... Early on, when he first introduced her to us... She got along pretty well with me, because I, I was knowledgeable of all the internet brain rod things she would mention. But she was very, very insistent. I'm not really saying very specifically what it was, and then it turned out it was that. You know? Alright. So I'm just gonna go over here. We should be good, and... Gosh, Dad, did I manage to stun any of them? Did you stun any of them? Oh, I missed that. Uh, oh, goodness. I'm gonna have to take some time to make sure I get all of them, and... 
that down, put that up. What can I get? Okay, well, that's... There we go, we can punch them all down. Oh, that was really good! I didn't think that Yai's turret placement could actually get her to teleport like that. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Punch down here, and... Go for that. Yeah, I... Somehow that does not surprise me. How many more do I need to plunge before I... There we go. Those are some crazy plunges. Oh my goodness. Okay. How much more do we got? Okay, Hydra on first... Yeah, Hydra on first half. Shop one should go. Second half could be the aggravate. Let's see. Yeah, second half should be the aggravate. Jop lunge on first. First half. Okay. I think I'm understanding this. The thing about the Farazon team is that the ideal rotation. Yeah. Oh my goodness. It's just. How, how serious is she? How serious is she versus just plain old delusional? Because I'm curious, but I feel like whatever the answer is, it'll disappoint me. Yeah, it's just... It... It's interesting how... And this is a weird topic. How they've generally kind of converged on the idea that... Baku, Deku is quote-unquote more feminine. It's... It's weird. Every now and then, some people... I just remember years ago they'd do that arguing about Naruto, and it's just... I'm glad that some people have that much free time. <laughs> That's all I'll say. Come on, come on. Okay, the thing about this is... Yeah, that... But the funny thing is, is that besides that legitimately being incredibly regressive, is that... It's also very culturally illiterate via the Japan. Yeah, it's... Oh, I... I don't doubt that at all. I just... Object to that on a philosophical level. Okay, and let's time this to make sure it doesn't hit me. There we go. Okay. Said I shouldn't be taking that much. Okay. So, the ro as soon as the rotation was... Got through everyone, they all died. And I'm not sure I got enough particles back to actually get the burst back for next time. Hmm. Oh, goodness. So... Does that mean your farming plans are... Kind of falling apart, or... Come on, come on. And just like that... And the interesting thing is that you actually want to go for just one single leap when you're using Xion Yun, because the- oh my goodness. Ah, uh, the leap- the number of leaps you do increases the damage, but that doesn't actually increase the amount of particles you get. Let's just see. Right, good luck farming. The weird thing to her- okay, I- I don't know what you're talking about. I- I'm a little frightened. Okay, let's just see. There we go, and we just got it with the ease. Stuff about... Yeah, I... I, I haven't heard about that. What, what are you... What are you talking about? I'm worried. I, I know nothing. I can probably guess? That doesn't make me happy. Okay, there we go, and... Yeah, that damage, that damage is good. This team is actually really, really strong. It doesn't have any healing, I guess you could... Well, it's... Used for an improper purpose. Somewhat inspired by its vague form and shape. That's what I would guess. When you have a sponge, I don't entirely follow. Okay, well, that'll be there. Now, feel free to say it. I promise it'll be alright. I'm not easily disgusted, really. Okay. Get this guy, even without the gator. 
Even without the gator, he goes down fast. Hmm. One, two, three, and let's just go through that. Can we get it? Can we get it back? We did not get it back. I would say. Hmm. Definitely go for the main stat one. For the attack one, main stats are always much more important than yeah. substats. Sometimes they can. It, if you have a really, really good piece, sometimes you would prefer something without a quote-unquote correct main stat. Oh, oh. Yeah, okay. Really nothing can surprise me anymore. I hate to say it, but it's true. Got okay, Yain yeah, first half then. And then Fischl in there. Second half. Yeah, but I would go with the attack sands, especially because... Does it have all of its stats rolled already? Yeah, it's... So, some people need serious help. I'll say that much. But what I'd say is... That is not what I was expecting. It's... It was in the ballpark, but... Someone did something relatively... Something tangentially related with... A drawing of Venti that they made. I think you probably know. Oh my! Oh, that's insane! You lucky. You lucky fool. Okay, well, let's put this down. Put this down. And actually, this is just gonna be straight. Electro, but whatever. Whatever. Come on, come on, come on. Let's roll that, and... Vita. Come on, come on. And just... This is good. This is nice and good. Oh, that actually... Burns? Okay, cool. Turret, turret, okay. Yeah, that, that's good. Let's try this one out then. And this one, nicely enough, does not require any... N really nice thing about this specific Zhao team is that it doesn't take any specific positioning. Because if you use Bennett as good as he is, you really need to stay in the circle. And that's really hard with Shao, because he's knocking enemies far away, no matter what you do. And... is this gonna be it? Oh my goodness, he got stuck on the monument. So silly. Okay. Go for the... Sprint should actually be pretty useful for this. Let's try this one out. One, two, three, Geo Bishops. Okay. And luckily, they're very, very vulnerable to knock back. The one thing is just the possibility of not working out. As in, I was gonna say, possibility of... Oh my goodness, I'm going insane. Oh, and that took burst away, whatever. Come on, come on. Shouldn't be too bad. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, and just leave Swirl Aggravate, that was pretty good, and, oh, whatever. Just keep on going. Knock him down like this, put that down, and... Wait, is Oz down or not? Or... Oh my goodness. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh, we're in a dangerous, we're in a dangerous place. Come on, come on. Yeah, spin out, spin out. Okay. First half. I might actually need to use the health regeneration one. Mm, okay. The swirl should help, probably. Oh, don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. Okay, come on. Come on, and just like that. Plunge, hit, and just like that. Come on, come on, come on, and go over there. Hi! Come on. Oh my goodness. What? What? Okay. And one more. Nice! So Zhao did it well. It helps when you can Swirl a bunch of things with every hit you do. Crit. Yeah, that's good. 
any kind of crit stats on feathers, and feathers are usually the ones you can, as I'm sure you know, afford to get kind of substat focused with. Given that their main stat will never differ. Same with flower. That's good. I'd take that. Okay. Get this one out. Oh, Ruin Drake Skywatch. Hello there. Get this out, and... Hello, hello. Let's go do this. Get that shine, and... I call... Two, three... Oh, and you've fallen down. Lovely. So once Oz is gone, we will... Okay, well, Oz is not gone. Mm -mm. Okay, then. Count this team one more time. And this should be really good. This should be fine. Okay, cool. And just like this. Out of the way. Hello. Hello. Where am I? Oh, I'm not actually refracted yet. That's good. Okay. Let's see if we can hit you, knock you up. Come on, come on. Come on. Okay, and that was actually out of the way. So you can dodge it vertically, not just horizontally. Yeah, that was a pleasant surprise. Okay, cool. And we actually managed to dodge that too. Come on, come on. Second half. Let's try this out. We actually managed to correctly get the... Am I refracted now? Maybe. Either way. Okay. Here we go. And one more. One more should do it. Plunge. Boom. Oh, what? What? Oh, there was one more. One more over there? Weird. Okay. Come on. Yeah, I... The silly there. Okay, let's just punch this down again. Put this out, and... Okay, there we go. Come on, come on. Here we go. One more, one more, and... You're over here. I did not quite do it. And Furina knocked her down while I was bursting. Okay. Oh, this should be good. Actually, let me see. I can collect some rewards now, some Mora. I think I'll actually use that to get enough Mora to level up Farz on just a little bit. Try to take her talents to nine, cash in some Stardust for Mora. Let's see real quickly, how much Mora do we have? So we need 135. 1 million, 350,000. That would be around 40,000 more. Okay. Just get that from shop. Crit rate wise? Oh, goodness. Are you trying to go for a crit rate circlet then, eventually? Okay, purchase Stardust Exchange. We need 40,000. It's not 400,000. B, four, eight, eight hundred. Oh, yeah, that's not bad at all. There we go. Cool. Yeah. In the end, if you ever need more help grinding, I'm more than happy to oblige. Nothing else that helps me meet my time markers for Genshin during the stream event. Because for the first couple of patches, I was trying to get everything every patch had done during that patch. And then they started putting out patches that didn't add new areas or were otherwise less active. And I realized maybe I should try to leave things for next time. Once I hit my 30 hour marker, not barring events that happened during the latter half of the patch. I won't say a single thing on that topic. I know better than to buy the hand that feeds me. Yep, we can upgrade for on a little bit more. Get... That's just skill damage. Okay. And... So that gives us a little bit more animal damage bonus. If we wanted to, I guess we could take it to even higher if we really wanted to. But nah, that's basically nothing. It's about as good as it gets. Cool. And now with our... Newly 999 Farazan and somewhat less newly 999 Zhao. We can go for it. Hmm... Um, the big thing with this Animo team is paying attention. Because if you proc Fav with Farazan, you just burst immediately and then switch out. 
if you're trying to proc Fab. And to be fair, the team doesn't really need Fab. It's got a crazy amount of particle generation from Furina and Shanyun already. Especially since my Farzan has an ER Sands anyway. She could probably maybe deal with attack. But I don't really. Her damage contribution is basically nil anyway. Okay. This... The fact that this team does not... The second team doesn't have any healing whatsoever... Might maybe be a bit of an issue. I don't think it will. But it's something I'll need to keep in mind. Just can't afford to be stupid. And honestly, the first chamber is actually the worst. In my opinion. Because Ruin Serpent is so RNG dependent and stunning it is kind of a crapshoot too. But when it's not that bad and the final chamber is basically free. Okay, moving here. Just like this. Come on. And the trick is hoping that they line up in a way that you can hit both of them with most given attacks. Come on, come on. If you're really lucky, you can get collision plunges on both. Which, now this might take a restart. I'm not entirely sure. And, come on. Yeah, because I'm not actually hitting the other one. The other one is not... A yeah, that was really bad. I won't accept that. As one of it isn't difficult, and it's not really all that random... But you need a good amount of time for it, I've tested. And the best way to do that is to ensure that you've got all of your bursts full for the first team at the end of Chamber 1. So... That's... that's pretty good. Okay. Let me see... And this out. Uh, I would say that the ideal would be... My Bennett has something around 250. Which might sound like overkill, but the big thing about it is that, like I said, Bennett's own damage contribution is pretty negligible. And giving him that much ER ensures that his energy will recharge in pretty much any team he uses on. And just like that, and focus on the other one. Come on, come on. Go over. Get a bloom. Now that... Whether, it's, you, whether that is sufficient or not heavily depends on... the team you're running and the weapon you're running because with sacrificial that should be more than enough but it's very dependent on and let's just see oh goodness that might be bad well actually oh goodness come on come on and just be there and can we get you uh, okay let's actually just main dps per zone for a little bit. Come on. Good amount of healing. There we go. Yeah. Either way, as long as it works for you, Abyss is only a small part of the game that I do just because everything else has gotten kind of too easy. It's not mandatory in the slightest. The Prima Gems you get from it is not all that significant anyway. Oh, it's just... Let's go that, and how many are we gonna... There we go, pretty good. Okay, over there, and just like that. Make sure, and the nice thing is, is that even though it's underground now, it should still get hit every now and then. There we go, we got a few more of those. Let's just make sure... Uh, no aggravates, but... Yeah, whatever. Come on, come on. Sit. Okay, nice. Come on, come on. Oh, goodness. Why is it not... Weird? Weird. Oh, goodness. Okay, that actually worked somehow. Okay. Interesting. Okay, and just like... Well, whatever. Come on, come on. Should... This is scuffed. Incredibly scuffed. Should still be able to make it work. Okay, we still got the... Put all that on the field. That down. Right. And just swirl. That down again. And we should be good. Okay, stay out of the way. And boom, boom, boom. On field the eye did it. It's such a silly team. It's such a silly team. The fact that it... Well, actually, it's not all that silly. Because a lot of it is just the synergy between Yai having good fast normals that already apply Electro. 
which means that she can drive both officials at A4 and C6 if you have it very, very well. But still. So nobody is actually high enough health right now. To... Well, okay. Come on, come on. We're gonna drive the arena. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see how many birds we can... Oh, goodness. Let me get that bird. Bird, bird. Okay. Nice. That's my name now? No, this is a lot of- yeah. Oh, same. I really love his kit. It sucks. And he just is not good. Well, never say never. Come on, come on. And the animals, animals, animals. Die, die. Okay. Yeah, we got that one. Got three. I only have C0. I only got him after his relevant event. Honestly. Turn off autocorrect. I turned off autocorrect a long time ago. I have not regretted it once. Well, that does it. It's got to restart because the eye died. Yeah. Gaming's big constellations are C4 and C6. A C4 really helps his energy and, well, suit yourself. Put an exception, maybe. And... Mm -hmm. like that. Come on, come on. Let's just get the bird action and see if... Come on. What? What? Ah, no. oh, please. Not the vortex. And just that. Yeah. See if I can collision plunge with anyone. Probably not. Okay. Oh, well, alright. Come on, come on. Scoop the last. Okay, cool. Come on, come on, come on. Fair. And just like this. Oh, burning, burning. She's not on field, so she can't take damage. That's good. That's what... Oh, that... Oh, that might be really bad. Now, getting hits on it before I can... Right before I can use the burst is not helping matters. That said, final chamber isn't bad. But C1 ga C4 gaming severely decreases the energy recharge requirements. And C6 just makes this special plunge is really, really strong. Okay, so let's just get out of the way and over there and put that down, put the official down, and then come on, come on. Okay, now you're coming out. Nice. Now, come on, come on. Okay, cool. There we go, there we go, there we go. Come on, come on. Hi, hi. And plunge over there. You real quick and do that. Break it down. Okay, cool. You're hitting one to the ground. It honestly doesn't actually seem like it. Okay. Come on, come on. Damage. I guess she just has better artifacts than you might have expected. Come on. Oh, goodness. Please, please, please. There, get that and... Okay, do we get it? Do we get it? Or... There we go. Okay, cool. Swirl, 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 and put this down. Let's just do this. Come on, come on. This should be helpful. Okay. And then just look at that and swirl, swirl, swirl before it goes away entirely. Okay. Hmm. That wasn't crazy, crazy, but not bad. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Make sure that that comes that down. You're fine to get that there. This, the nice thing about this team is that the rotation isn't that long. It's really nice to what it has going for it. That, do that, and I just can't actually put official down right now. It's getting closer than I expected and wanted. Hi. Back. Come on, come on, come on. Swirl, swirl, swirl. Hit, hit, hit. Okay. Get it? We did get it. Okay. Come on, come on. Just like that, just like that. Kinda, kinda. And so let's just actually get the bullets. What? Well, I... Oh, I was actually inadvertently hitting it. Well, if it works, it works. Oh! No leveled artifacts? Well then, what weapon does she have? So that'd be big for the crit damage. And to be fair, even at level 0, artifacts do already give a decent amount of stats. Energy recharge should help with that. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. 
There we go. Oh, Fav. Oh, in that case, in that case, the crit really confuses me. I, I don't know. Good for, I'm glad you're lucky, then. That's good. Oh, that's just dash out of the way. Make sure and the little bit of crowd control is really helping. Okay. Come on, come on. Come on. Let's make sure everyone groups up. Okay, now it's time to bring it back down. Everyone will okay, in that case, that... I guess you just got really good substat rolls. Can't think of anything else. What artifact set? Because I run Tenacity on my Farazon. It's just... At a C6, which I believe you have... She can get Tenacity with 100% uptime via pressurized collapses because they count as skill damage. Well, let's actually put this down. Cool. Come on, come on. Scroll that. Scroll that. Okay, cool. And just put that And yes. Come on, come on. Hit, 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 hit. There we go. And official. It's gonna do it. Okay, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Let's see, start disappearing. We won't do more things. There we go. We're kind of jamming. We are kind of jamming. Okay, let's just go get that. It's starting to disappear now, I think. Okay, cool, cool. Swirl, swirl, and hit. Hit, swirl. Okay, oh goodness. Well, whatever. And it should actually charge another down, maybe. Well, whatever. And did that do it? Did that do it? Well, whatever. Whatever. Come on, and official. Hit that, and then we just. For a bit more. And blood drink. That's doing it. Okay. Come on, you're gonna come up again in a little bit. Come on. Oh, oh, okay. Then that's probably making the difference, I would assume. Down in there, come on. Okay, and swirl, swirl. Okay, put that down. Nidita, Nidita. Oh, okay, that that would definitely be the one to hit that. Come on, come on, just go and burst that down. Okay, good damage, good damage. And let's see. There we go. And we got my 36 stars. Nice. Okay. And the Yai Aggravate team did it. And that's on crazy. Yeah, that team is not as overpowered as a lot of my others in particular. The El Haytham team would have taken that white drake down in two rotations instead of three. Of about the same length. Still good. Still really, really good. Hmm. And be frank, the fact that the rotations for it were quite short was also nice. Oh, nice. Yeah, Witsith? Witsith is an interesting weapon. Because it is strong, but it's incredibly RNG. RNG dependent. Is that part of why you wanted to run an EM Wanderer? To try to get more use out of the... <sighs> EM roll? That makes sense. But that said... In a certain way of thinking... The less EM you build on Wanderer already, so do I, actually. But that's mainly because I use Dodogo Tails on him in Overworld. But the thing about Yai is... No, no. The thing about Widsith and Wanderer is that the less EM you have built on him already, the more utility you'll get out of the EM bonus when it happens. Because EM has straight up diminishing returns. It's not just opportunity costs, but actual diminishing returns. Mm. Okay, okay. Hmm. Right. And this is not the right person. Wait, is it? 
Yeah, it's not the right person. Okay, Little Lou, one who has a duel for this week. Let's do this real quick. Okay, okay. Hmm. Do these, then I'll do Four Drums Temper, but there's also a special battle mode for this month. Okay. Okay, take your time. So who do I want to put in? I guess Nanayu Nanayumi could be okay. Thanks. See you in a bit. Do mm -hmm. Zod. Put down Paimon too, actually, and then put down Libin. Actually, if I want to be funny, nah, nah, nah. I'll be alright. Be funny, I could put down another Paimon, but actually, no, no, no. Put down. Maybe an Anatsuki? Eh, no, I'll put down. I'll run Fischl. Probably switch. No, actually, Fischl is the one I want to tank. Fischl of anyone. Okay. This is a fun team. But it's different. Hmm. Yeah, that is a bit obnoxious. Hmm. Okay. Roll these real quick. Then. Oh. Uh, hmm. Play another Paimon, I suppose. It's per round. Oh, but she's not going to be using her skill again this round. Eh, I don't know. Put that down anyway. And then... <sighs> Natsuki. Could use that to replace, maybe. Well, alright. Put down... Lucky Dog on somebody, maybe. Actually, what I could do is actually... Eh, but I'm not putting Agent in. Let's see. Oh, burst. All right. Hmm. Don't quite like the sound of that. Hmm. This is a decent one, though. Very same time. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna change a few of these around in order to actually use. A Hydro Mimic. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Switch around, or where are you gonna go? Mm. Oh, goodness. That Shen has doing some pretty freaky damage. Okay. Well, alright. Alright. Hmm. 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 All right. Maybe. Could use one artifact and then switch to another. Uh, uh, seal myself up real quick and. So many dudes are just going down. Okay, don't worry about it. But it went well. It went very well. How the heck is... How on earth did Chen have just totally wipe everyone? Well, this team does take a bit of time to get going. That is true. But still... How are you just snowballing like that? Well... I might be able to salvage some of this. No damage and stealth. Actually, oh, but yeah, that, this would be the best option for now. Goodbye. Goodbye. There's the end of the round. Maybe I should 
can actually do that. But actually, I'll just use the burst. There we go. Okay. Hold on, come on. Okay. And put Libin out. There we go. Should hopefully be able to turn this around. We'll see. Hmm. Got rid of you. Get a little bit of electro charges on there. Hmm. Okay. Probably get a heal from the clan and then. Put the crisp on him to make sure he takes less damage next time, too. Or actually, well. Hmm. Three, minus three. Hmm. This could be better, but it could also be worse. It's complicated. Okay, heal up a little, too, and. Yep, back at, back at full. One! What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Okay. One more. One more. Okay, yeah. There's nothing they can do to me at this point, actually. It's in the bag. Cool. Glad I had someone to act as anchor, and then Oz will tap her down. There we go. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Hmm. Longer than I have. Okay. Go for one and see how this one works. Here you are. TCG, opposing deck. This should be fine. Okay. Hmm. She's out. Should be alright. Okay. Mm hmm okay. Who do I want to? This could be okay. Maybe. Torihara no Torihara Hmm. That's that's not bad. Put this on you. Use a few fewer hydro dice. That on. Switch out, put it official. Okay, that's dealing a bit more damage, but. But it's not fast, and that's the thing. This whole thing is doing decent damage to the whole team. Hmm. Okay. Well, maybe we'll be alright. Be able to hit at least a few. Hmm. Okay. I'll kill of that one at least, but still. It's not the card event, it's I'm doing the card event, these are just weekly duels. Okay, well hmm. What should I do? Probably get another one down. Alright. Once I'm done with the weekly duels, I'll do the two card events. Why do I want to? Hmm. This is kind of silly. I have to change a lot of dice to make this work. It's a really, really bad roll. In that case, put one down, refresh Oz's uses, switch to Oceanid. This will be good. This should be good. Where are the winds? Oh, goodness. I didn't even think it just swirl like that. Well, whatever. Whatever. Strike normal attack. Gonna switch again? No, you aren't. Okay. Someone needs a bit of healing, and I guess I'll go for Oceanid. Sure. For Rodea. I never even really paid attention, but she's got a lot of Hydro Mimics in the background of her card art. I never paid attention to the big one. Okay, just a little bit of damage. There's nothing to swirl. Do a good amount of damage. And with that, we'll get another electro charge off and do even more damage. Cool. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay. Well, out of it. Hinges on. What enemy the enemy ends with. Should be. Let's see. Which is to Thunder Arrow. Hide after it attacks. We could end the round now and still win. We could throw away this turn and still win. So that's what I'll do. Home decor is the end of the round. There we go. Didn't even have to move. It's the power of a summons oriented deck. Takes some time to set up, but once it gets set up, it basically plays itself. Okay. Play still done and not done. What's up my deck? Funny that we still know basically nothing about the place. That said, and I thought about it on my own, but found someone else who agreed in it, agreed with it, but also they, their post was entirely in Spanish. But essentially, the War of Debate Club, combined with what Nuviet says at the end of the Fontaine Archon quest, suggests some interesting things regarding that one. It's a skill that you can work on with time. But. Okay, that's good. That's really good. But. As I was saying. The Lore of Debate Club talks about all of these characters who are named after African and South American culture heroes. And their companions, who are all described. Who are all named after various cryptids from African and South American folklore. And given that Nuviet says that dragons have sort of changed in that line and live lived along humans, if I recall correctly, there's a suggestion that those companions were all referring to dragons and that Natlan will be a land of dragons in a specific sense of basically dragon riders, and that not one will introduce a mount mechanic. A dragon mount mechanic. And... It definitely makes sense. It's... Trivially true that, yeah, it's gonna be the place where people live alongside dragons. I'm not sure if that means dragon mounts, but it would be cool. The big thing is just... What can a phone run? And, to be fair... They've definitely been counting on phones getting better as they've kept putting stuff out. I'm not sure how long they can continue counting on that. Especially given that not one will be coming out in, what, eight months? Six months, actually? But still, six, seven. It's interesting to think about, at least. So who do I want to... Who can I throw in? None of them are really going to summon anything. Well, actually, eh, it's not a real important summon. Well, they've been testing it for a while. The thing about it, though, is that you need to pay extra to use it. Which makes it an unattractive proposition to a lot of people. Because the kind of people who need to use Cloud are, quite frankly, the kind of people who... They're, they need that because they don't have the cash for a PC in the first place. I've seen... I, I, I have never... I never heard that. Was that official communication? But either way... What comes to mind for me is... I had seen pictures of it and they were talking about... There was this mention on the menu with, with cloud coins. And it was just sort of... The only thing I ever saw was very clearly monetized, which makes sense, but a lot of it is just the kind of, if someone doesn't have 
a good PC to play the game. It is likely, at least in part, due to not having a lot of cash. So saying, yeah, just use the cloud, which also requires cash, is not necessarily a foolproof, all so one size fits all solution. Well, it's scarcity would it would it, scarcity would exist under any system. Well, I can't actually do much. Don't have any free switch, and I don't have any. Let's say maybe I should have gone for. Actually, what I could do is put down a couple more minutes to refresh a few. I don't know. Let's get rid of this real quick. And, oh, but no. Uh, that's not gonna kill me. That's not gonna kill me. You can't kill me this turn. That's good. That's said. Put down a couple. Yep, that'll refresh a few uses and probably deal a good amount of spread damage. Oh, but they're probably gonna knock out Rode next round. I made a little oopsie whoopsie. Mm -hmm. Right after she got her burst up too. This is literally so sad. It's a hard team to play, what can I say? Be really funny if you just did that, so I... <sighs> Only took one damage instead of getting sniped and... Ito going for the kill. Unfortunately, I don't think I can hope for that amount of kindness from the AI. Hmm. Okay, then. What are you gonna do? Yep, okay, you are going to be nice to me. How much damage the burst would deal? Deal six, so actually, I use this, I can snipe. And that'll probably mean a dead Rodea, but I'll just use Ito's deal and then... Use the Ito card, and then just use Fischl's Burst. Oh, but she... Oh, going for the Goro Burst now? Interesting. Okay, okay. There we go. Instant. Nice. Okay. Let's do it. There we go, there we go. It remains incredibly cool how... Fischl's TCG Burst is firing Oz as an arrow. Few things will ever be as heavy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Challenge Lector. Okay. Keep on going. One more guest challenge. Room for improvement. Last one should be... It's gonna be a character and... Oh! It's her boy. Albedo of the insufficiently fluffy hair. Okay. In that case, we can go on and do a couple of player matches in the event, and then I'll spend the remaining three and a half to four hours clearing out more of Chenny Vale. Alright. Pretty good game plan to me, it sounds like. But, uh, uh, yeah, okay. They might fix it one day. I've heard speculation. Probably entirely baseless, but what can you say? What can you do? Mm, okay. Let's put in... Hydro dice. See how all this goes. Oh, uh, this might be bad. This might be... Oh. So many dendro dice. Still hope we make this work, but... Uh, it's gonna suck. You know what? Let's reset this. He can get his victory or something. Okay. Who do I want to put down? Uh, that... It's not amazing. The ideal is getting both Liban and Natsuki, if I recall correct. I mean, Liban and Dunrazad. Okay, let's put in... Fischl, spread around a bit of electro. Kanemetote. Now down first. Hmm. Okay, so this is decent actually. You can put that on you. Put down Oz, switch out, and then get some mid Also. 
Make mimics easier to place down every, every round in the future. Okay. Come on, come on. Oh, when he puts down his funny flower. Okay, I wonder how he will try to crystallize this, if at all. We'll see. Oh, just normal attack. Goofy. Here we go. Gonna switch. Oh, you can't actually switch. Wait. She tag one last once per round. Okay. Hmm. All right. Here we go. Oh, he's got his burst up. That's not great. Oh, but since he ended his his round first, it broke the shield on my mimic. Okay, that's not bad. Because it actually hit back. Gonna burst? Are you going to burst? I hope you- okay, you aren't going to burst. Good for me. Ha. Huh. That, uh, maybe go for another action. I probably will. Hmm. Could do that. I think I will. Down another. Maybe switch to official and actually use the... Store signs on her. And then just burst next round quickly? Maybe. After putting down another Oz to replace this one. Switch. This is on her. Don't need to use that for anything. There we go. Cool. On the next round, deal a bit more spread damage. And yeah. We'll be jamming. This thing is, is that if you stay in, when I put down Oz, I'll get another Electro Charger reaction off and deal a bit more spread damage. Hmm. I don't think I can get that many bursts off this round, but we'll see. Should I leave that... Mm, no, I'm only going to be using official, so that Hydro Die can go. Okay. Mm, all right. Come on. Okay, you're just going to use that again. Okay, cool. I don't think you can really hurt me that much, but another Electro Charge reaction off. If you switch to someone, I will snipe him. Switch to somebody. Yeah, switch to Klee. Oh my goodness, you are playing right into my hand. So, go for that. Take most of you out. There we go. Brutal. Okay. Okay. It's one down already. Dead, but that doesn't matter. Actually, what we could do is... I want to be really funny, and this is pointless. It's just... Adding insult to injury. Get rid of that flower. Goodbye. So this will kill. It. I was taking advantage of their behaviors. I didn't do much. Okay, and yep, Albedo's down. And Oz will finish them off. Cool. Okay. Buy another skin, I believe. Kimino Kachida, it's your victory. Okay. Here we go, and let's see. Card shops, commodities. This we could get. These are the only three dynamic skins we still have to get. Let's pick this up then. Don't have her yet because I actually haven't dueled any of the new characters in. That's fine. It's got a cryo emblem in the background. Does the Octro and have an Electro? But it does. It's a little harder to see it, but it's still got the emblem there. Okay. Okay. Hmm. So next week, well, tomorrow actually, I'll be able to get exactly enough, well, more or less exactly, just barely enough coins to get both of those skins too, because that's 6,000 or so every week. Sure. Okay, we got... Get a battle mode. Do that in a little bit. Thank you, thank you. And also, get this mission done. The only thing left would be, in that case, to use a bit more resin. Go back and fight a boss again then. Let's see real quick. Hmm. What drums temper in this? Let's check this out. Maximum difficulty. 12 usages. 
by one. Huh. Oh, Usi aligned, reduced. Fast action charge of Numa energy. Three fewer elemental dice once per round. Usi aligned, piercing. This is just... You just use Lynette. Lynette is still literally the only Usia character in the game. In the TCG, at least. So funny. So actually, let me let me think. So I could deactivate them pretty easily, but... Previous... Uh, uh, huh. Second down this round. Yeah! She's still the only Usia character, period. I wonder if I could try maybe using some Marchasse on this, actually. I've never used the Marchasse artifacts. Well, actually, it's... They've only got this one right now, or is healed. Elemental die, that... Yeah, this... That's not bad. But actually... Okay, that would just be a die. She wouldn't really be taking all that, all that much damage, I don't think. Now, overawing Assault... Another free die is not bad. Just trying to figure out how I should actually make this teamwork. Hmm. That's... Hmm. Opposing character uses a skill. Ah, huh. One additional energy once per round. Actually, I think Fav would actually probably be our best option. Let's see. Let's check those rules again real quick. Opponent switch character a fast action. Oh, a fast. Oh, that. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. That. Okay. Huh. So Lynette would help, but a lot of it just it's gotta be finding a way to spam burst. Okay, but the fact that it's a fast action, that the enemy switches a fast action, is gonna... And that might be... Oh, actually, no. That's actually good. That might be good. Hmm. Depending on whether... Okay, so in that case, Aquala could actually be good, because it would mean... She would actually get healed when the opponent uses the skill. Hmm. Many things to think about. Mental type entering play. When entering play. Hmm. Okay, well. These ones are always good, but I feel like trying out a bit of Marchussi on Lynette. Hmm. Heal and damage, active character, draw one card. Uh, uh, not really, though. I'm thinking. I'm thinking hard. Long and hard. Paramount Air. That's decent. That's decent. Ivan's good. Actually, Ellen could be useful, too. And Kujura is basically free, because since... Not actually playing with anyone on the other side. They don't do anything by way of dice. Hmm. So confusing things. Confusing things. It's a good one. Won't even be playing cards though, so Fontaine Ar Arcane Legend would not make any real difference. Take two of the crisps. You know what? We'll do that. Okay, so Lynette's the main gonna be the main one here. Besides that, I guess maybe I could take someone just for healing, like Barbara. I don't know. Ideally, somebody who could get burst up fast. Huh. This is this is confusing. How much? Mm hmm. It's only two. I guess I could put Lenny in to be funny, but I don't know. It none of this means much. I hope this works. Let's try this. 
Okay. Mental burst. Okay. Draw the usages. Burst three fewer dice per round one time. This this is okay. This is this is pretty good. Talisman burst assault Lucio once per round. Burst line piercing damage. Okay. What best immunity to defeat? So there's one. Okay. To be in the Numa state. If only I could get rid of that. Fortunately, there's no way to actually do anything in goodness. If only I could put Fremen A in. That would be really fitting. They would all be together. Hmm. Hmm. So, let's see. Let's see. How many can I get? How many takes damage or is healed? Okay, so let's just think. Actually, I could put Ellen down. Putting Ellen down would work. So would... No, that wouldn't work. Ellen down, it would take one. Then I get one die back for taking damage. Let's get use of that, frankly. Let's use one. That will deal with you. Yep, there we go. Fast action, you'll hit me. Come on, hit me. There we go, just one, that's fine. And we got another die back, and we can use a burst. Cool. Now this isn't complicated. Light up. Light up. Okay, cool. There we go, cool. And that's the end of that round. And a little bit more. Oh my goodness, that's really, really gone. Yeah, this is just... Use Lynette. I'm okay with that. Mind you, I have no problem with that. Uh -huh. So you're gonna hit me. Oh, from the taunt, actually. That's good. That's pretty good. So who do I want to... Bit from... Well... I don't want to go for... Let's put this down for a bit of extra dice later on. Okay. Get a bit of health back, too. Oh, but you're gonna burn me now, aren't you? Oh, that might be bad. Best action... Okay, no, just a normal. Okay. I still need to... Switch some of these through. Mmm, bad. But, in, but actually, could we... Yeah, for a bit of elemental damage, sure. Be able to use another burst again after that. Cool. So it's not actually doing too many attacks per round, either. Cool. Goodbye. Fresh those uses. I think we should be good here. Not doing damage all that fast, but it's just a matter of letting Lynette do her thing. Hmm. Just so that's all gone. It's all gone now. I guess once someone's off the field, we can go for a bit more. We'll see. Who are they going to switch to, and what are they going to do? Either way, these rolls, these dice are not good. Not very conducive. Hmm. Okay. Smash and okay, just one. That's good. That's pretty good. But, but, as we can keep marking you down with the Usia, should be in a pretty good state. But now we finally actually got types of damage on the Bottle Cat. Mm -hmm. Fast action, pummeling, okay. Could get another card? Mm -hmm. Did we really get a card? Whatever. Mm -hmm. Is this to turn a lot into Animo Dice? Not too great. Hmm. It's another burst. I guess we could put down two Libens. That would be funny. No, no, no. Eh, whatever. Okay. Go use another burst. Okay, end of that round. Definitely gonna hit me again. But... 
Oh, but that... Did that actually put it back to... It made it animo again. That is probably not so good. Add down. Add down. Get rid of... Yeah, the piercing damage is good. Okay, Ten Chicago doesn't guarantee it. Let's see how this works. Mm-hmm. Yeah, alright. More damage. Three, three per. Hmm. Oh, no, that actually... If I can actually swirl that, I should be in good shape. Okay. Is that... I would think... Let's check. Uh, get more dice from that Liban, but... Tracking Trudgeon... Wait. Oh, that actually... That's good dime for me. Yep, no damage there. And actually just... Swirl that. Both of you with that. That was good. So what are you going to do now? Numa, Numa... Oh, but... Oh, right! I keep forgetting. If you swirl with an Usia character, that swirl's also got Usia on it. Okay, well... All right. And that was pretty scuffed, but... Challenge complete. Okay. Cool. Got the platinum. Okay. To the next. Also, I should grab these boxes. Ah, oh, no space left in artifact inventory. I'll have to get rid of a few then. Alright, alright. Hmm. Hmm. Need to read that artifact alert eventually. Got okay, more Oh, uh, frankly I could do with more crit rate, but I'm a gambler sometimes. Sometimes. Mm -hmm. Strip and Spun will do a decent job of that, but it's just... Ah. Come on. Didn't even do it. Okay, let's get all these. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Okay. Alright. And back into Navi's artifacts. Cool. Go get rid of these. Do not want to use this right now. Cool. Okay. How many trash artifacts do I... Okay, I've got 23 before I have to go through again. That's decent. Mm -hmm. Next is Cycle Crisis. Omni die, draw one card once per round, support card. So having Dunyar's on the team would be good. Manifold Anguish. Increase. Hmm. Support zone is not full. Hmm. Okay. Gotta go on a hard mode again. Okay, so that just changed the number of shield points. So yeah. Anything in orange is what's marked. Welcome back. Omni die and draw one card once per round. You play a support card. It's gonna be support heavy then. Let's make a new new deck. Well, madness, probably. So basically, it's fill up my support zone as quickly as possible. Mm -hmm. How do I want to do this? The ideal would maybe be keeping as many characters who can stay semi permanently in there as possible. Well, I'll think about it. Because the more that can flow in and out, the more times I can benefit from the bonus you get from playing. Getting a card and an Omni die. That said, it's not huge, huge. It's not a huge bonus or a huge difference. It's a decently long haul. Decent long haul. Eh. Kujirai is pretty good. What do I want to do? Okay, parametric. 
It might be difficult to ensure that the timing there works out. We'll see. Decent enough. Let's think. Treasure seeking seely, sure. Huh. That this is gonna be. I want a full support zone. We can get a lot of elemental damage off on the enemy. But aside from that. Oh also, also, I should definitely keep some animo characters in. So that I could. This might be Jean's time to shine, actually. Because they're all gonna be Fatui. They're all gonna be shielded. Let's see. Yeah, they're all gonna be Fatui. They're all gonna be pretty shielded. Six shield points every action phase. So. Finding ways to swirl their shields down could help, especially if I can get Electro Charge. Or, no, superconduct reactions in, in order to deal piercing damage. Let's just think. So who could I do animo-wise? Because animo, animo would be good. Put in sucrose and... Let's see. How could I guarantee piercing damage? Well, well. Yeah, actually I could just... Let's think. Not Kaza. It might just be... Let's put in these three. Mondstadt animal clowns. Let's just think. Isomer, plus one. Uh, but it's not the elemental. Elemental I'm really worried about. This is on the field. Plus one animal damage. That might be okay. This could probably be pretty good too. Bit of additional switching, allergy, plus one damage, burst. Hmm. I don't think the weapons will be all that important though. Let's just think. I feel like Fab Sword could be good for Jean in that case. Could keep her burst up more quickly. That burst will be important. Okay, actually. Well, this is gonna be more of a speed thing than a durability thing, so I think I'll actually go for Emblem in lieu of the shield-based artifacts. But what else? What else could I think of? Blade, elemental reaction damage, draw one card, but cards aren't really the issue. Hmm. Well... Oh, oh, VV. VV could be good, too. Aside from that, let's get some nice cards that we can just keep in the support zone and weave there to take up space. Actually, actually, no, no, no. Fast action isn't a thing. I might actually want... Maybe, I'm not sure. Fast action, this, this will be okay. What achievement is the one, is that the one for lighting it on fire? Or... Let's try this out. Yeah, I'm wondering what, which one that might be. Huh. Just think. These are decent support cards to put in. I think I could do pretty well with these, especially since a lot of them are zero cost. Hold anguish, characters, plus one. Support zone. Hit state. Oh, oh, that one. Okay. Don't worry, I understand. This one on the element, their defenses advance. Manifold anguish, enhancing will, surging will. Oh, so, oh, so it doesn't actually keep take up space there. That makes sense. Let's think. Who do I want to put in? Oh, oh, interesting. Do you have him already, or are you just hoping he gets rerun? Who do I want to put in? Who do I want to put in? Well, it shouldn't really, really matter. Did he go through another wall in Star Rail? Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. How do you plan on building him? Are you gonna build him Bloom like a sensible person? Got resupply, Kuzurai. This is... Okay, there we go. Hmm. Gains one energy, two once per round. Well... 
The only person you're hurting by doing that is yourself. I'm sure you know that. Let's see. It deals elemental damage. Let's think. What do you mean Genshin reward thing? Let's actually... That down. Deal some elemental damage. Cool. Support zone. Oh, but it's... They deal... Freezing spray. Oh, but it's gonna... Ooh, I don't necessarily like that. Let's think. Let's think. So it won't be able to go if it's in my support zone. Let's think. Oh, oh, it's it's just the stream event. Just the streaming event. <laughs> that went... Wait. Your elemental... Receives elemental transfer into their support zone. Oh, okay, so... I could have waited, actually. Hmm. Well, let's think. This is okay. Let's just use some of this, then. Switch you. Hi. What are you gonna do now? What are you gonna... Oh, baby. That might hurt me. That might hurt me a lot. Now, that'll hurt me a lot. Okay. Receives, receives, receives. So definitely need to switch. Guess who needs to put more people in the support zone next round? Me. Okay. Mm, Alright. That might not have been a very good distribution. And frankly, having everyone animo is really putting a lot of eggs in one basket. Ah, we'll think about it. Hmm. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Now this... I'm gonna have to figure this one out. I think the way to do it is definitely gonna be putting in... characters, because I'm going to get both of those back right now. That'll suck. Uh, huh. Yeah, Kujirai, that was a bad way to do this. I need... I need to put in support cards which will stick around and not leave my support zone. So not Kikujirai, but Ellen. Some like Ellen. Tenshikaku. Ones that leave are not ones that I should be using. Ones that disappear are also ones I probably shouldn't be using. But that one especially will not be good. Because it'll help them fill up their own. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, you should be able to get a few materials. It's nothing major, but it's nice to have. Mm -hmm. This. Let's try this out and hope it works. Prayers. This. Not bad, not bad. Mm hmm. Actually, switch out everything that isn't a support card right now. Yeah, this should maybe be okay. Let's think. Sucrose can go in. People who don't need healing can go in before. I need to do anything healing wise. That's okay. That was a pretty good starting roll. Okay. All right. All right. In that case. That case. Ellen. Here we go. Put down Libin. Parametric for now, I suppose. Sure, that could work. Wait. Uh, uh, no, that should have been treasure seeking. Whatever. Okay, forcibly switch. At least I kinda know what I'm doing, I think. Use one on me, use one on me. Hit me, maybe. Well, let me think. Actually, I'll switch to Jean, maybe. Possibly. Yeah, because that, that's going to proc that and give me dice that I did not want to use. This is possibly salvageable, but dangerous territory. Yeah, I'm just going to try that again. There's a lot of ground to make up, and I don't quite like that. 
Try that again. This mono animo is a little silly, but yeah, treasure seeking silly. I have complete control over. That's the big thing. Do not have to worry about. <sighs> Accidentally having an enemy set it off. Which is why it also costs less, because it technically takes a bit more to activate, but in this case it's actually quite good for us. Okay. That down. Put that down. Put that down. And use Gale Blade. Then probably just end the round right here. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, that's pretty good then. That's good. I hope. Should fill up a couple of alive bins. Should fill up one of them. Let's see. Okay, they're just switching back to use that again. I'll be at half health. No, no, that don't... Five? What? Five. Wait. Received, yeah, so... How did that deal that much damage? Received by your characters. Plus one. Is that... Oh, okay, that's just how much damage it deals normally. That's insane. Okay, that frost cannon would straight up kill me. Oh my goodness. That's not good. No, we could... We could put down... That on you, actually. That might be the move. Switch over. Put down this, hope we get another supporter. We'll do that, do that, why don't you? Put down Ellen. Yeah. Oh, and we got... Got Vonarana out of that. That's actually incredibly good. Okay, and... Oh, but swirling! The shield is only on the active character. So swirling is really, really good for this. Okay, now I... Now I understand. That's really good. Can that move it in? That won't move it in. Okay, that's good. But... Something beautiful may have just happened. Means one MG after another character uses well. Let's fill up that support zone just to be, well, yeah, just to be sure. Let's be nice and careful about this. Okay, there we go. Try this out and... Mm -hmm. Oh, but you're not using elemental equipment? Wanderer? Well, the thing about him is that... He could get some good scroll damage going off. But he's very fragile and would rely the enemies already having auras. And it doesn't work too well if they actually stay in instead of just switching. He's very finicky. His peaks are really high, but he's easier to counter than you might expect. And certainly might hope. It's... it's certainly something. So that's actually not absorbing anything right now. So can I do a quick switch? Actually, the move over you're gonna switch to. Okay. So I've got enough energy there now. Nothing on me. We can just maybe we could put that on somebody else. Actually, do I need? Oh, but if I, that's Dandelion Breeze plus one Animo. Eh, that's fine. That's passable. Use that and. Use her burst, get a bit of healing up in here. There we go, okay, cool. Kenichika. Kenichika. And did that oh, but it doesn't immediately deal damage, that's right. Okay. Right, active character for one HP. Oh, that's not much. That's not much. I could try wander on this. We'll see. Little damage. And oh my goodness. That roll is insane. Okay. Will. Will. Let's 
see who we go see who we go for next. I think actually maybe Venti. He's on there and don't have anyone I can just quick switch into. That's the thing. Ha. Huh. Hmm. Uh alright. I'm gonna switch to someone I can put an element on or Hmm. Getting confused. Well... It's a lot more complicated than I expected, honestly. He's in the burst. Okay, now you've got something on you. Who do I want to put down? This is taking... some time to get going. That's definitely the rub. So I think I could do kind of okay. Maybe... Oh, nice. I can notice a little. Okay, it changed a lot in... Oh, so it was random and now it's... Because I was looking at my chat window and not the stream chat window. That was confusing me a little. VV, VV. Huh. Okay. This should hopefully work a little. We'll see. Okay, Shattered Gun. Ah, uh, okay. Got a few more cards. Let's think. Let's think through this. We need to put someone else down so that I don't lose anything. Crimson red. The color of blood. Ha. Huh. Actually put that on you. It's just gonna cost one animo die now. Can I put down actually? Oh, but that, I messed that up. Actually, no, we put on one more Vanarana. Oh, okay, well. Oh, because he's a supporter, and now. This. That's decent. That's decent. Should hopefully be able to find a way to figure out the next round. Huh. But, even still. I am. Okay, actually, let's see. Let's see. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty hopeful. Let's just try this out. One, and... How much will this deal? Four. Okay, we can do this. Definitely do this. As long as we can break that shield, we're good to go. What are you gonna do to me? Don't have any burst up right now. Yeah, but Animo is definitely the way to go to try to abuse Swirls. That was good. Didn't even really think that... I was only thinking about breaking the shields, but that still worked out quite well. Okay, so I need to put somebody in the support zone. This could work. That could work. It's just... Yeah, it's so silly. But it's definitely the animal gimmick. And it actually works quite well. Works even better in TCG, in my opinion. There we go. Done. And another Platinum should be. Cycle Crisis. Definitely sounds like it encourages Anima a little to me. But I didn't even think it would... The shield would only affect the character that was currently on field. That made a huge difference. It's called Dominance, beginning in black. Let's see how this works. These are... Large Hydro Slime, Gurgling Bubble. Oh, that's bad. And Cryo Slime, Jumping Slam. Opposing character is frozen. Have not been afflicted and have used a skill. Be unable to use skills during the next round. Hmm. How should I? Okay, so what's interesting is that the slimes actually... Wait. Okay, getting Gene involved would actually be... No, no, that wouldn't be good. I need to freeze them during the actual fight. Character, opponents who have not been afflicted didn't use the skill in this run, right? Not my own, the opponents. Well, they're fun. 
But the entire reason that they don't add Prima Gems is because TCG is so much unlike the rest of the game that there are a lot of people who just refuse to engage with it. They were unhappy that there were Prima Gem rewards for even the basic 10 levels. If they added Prima Gems to these events, people would probably start quitting. I'm not joking. So who should I use? Definitely someone who can apply Cryo pretty easily. The only one who really comes to mind would be... Sis and Mage. Actually, if I really wanted to be funny, what I would do... Excuse me. What I would do is actually... Could put in... It's all about keeping them frozen. Maybe Chongi went on field, but with somebody else who could deal Hydro. Chongyun and then a Hydro Catalyst? Yeah, something like Mona and Chongyun. That could work. So Mona gets a quick switch out. Chongyun, Mona, and then maybe another Cryo for. But I don't want someone who does Cryo damage at end of round, because that, that degree of freezing would not actually help, most likely. But... Hmm. At the same time, having somebody animal on there to just deal damage could help. But there's nobody except for Jean who has off-field animo that doesn't absorb. Which, honestly, I find it interesting that almost every animo damage burst has elemental absorption. Because that's actually a hard nerf. And I'm almost certain that that was deliberate. Because getting... Getting swirls that easily... Could get overpowered very, very fast. But... Let's just see. Who else do I want to put in? One more cryo character, probably. I could put in Senora. That would be fine. Oh, no, but Mona wouldn't work all that well, actually, because it's about finding a character who can deal Cryo with a standard attack and Hydro with a skill or something. That could... Oh, but someone who can actually infuse, because it needs... It is only Sword, Claymore, and Polearm. And you infuse. It could be... Actually... I feel like... Xing Chao really the only option? That's because she would self-infuse if, if Xing Chao does not have a self-infusion. That would work best. Well, the entire point is that in order to reliably freeze enemies, what I would do is infuse put Chang Yun's field down so that with a single character I could deal and they'd have to be Sword, Claymore, or Polarm, therefore, well, there are no Hydro, Claymore characters anyway. They would be able to deal Cryo damage with their normal attack and Hydro damage with their skill. So that they could freeze whatever enemy was on field without having to switch. That's kind of the puzzle here. Dice is the same type as La Senora. It's... I don't really need... I don't need that at all. So who would I want to put in? That's only for his own damage. Hmm. Multiple quick switching cards, like changing shifts. They're not changing shifts, let's leave it to me. Maybe a Catherine too. Which one did you end up doing then? Sack could be okay. That's alright. The swords, which ones do I want? Uh, I don't really need the additional energy. Okay, sack, two sacks. Okay. Then maybe Blizzard and Heart of Depth. It's all about just getting as many attacks off as possible. Gamblers could be okay, but I'm not sure whether I'll actually kill. Oh, oh, not Artifact Domain, but a... What... Weapon are you trying to level up right now? And that happens to me on that happens to me on Sundays too, more often than I would like to admit. Monarana, most of these are pretty nice to have. 
I could put down... That's a once per round. That's skill, original cost, but I don't have a lot of skills like that. Ten Catherine. Fast action is good. Weapon's okay. Timmy, eh. Okay, I'm going to be using a lot of normals and maybe... Skills too. Kujirai could be good. That's good too. Let's think. Oh, but the resonance, right. I want the resonance. So changing ships is good. What can I afford to take out? Actually, this should be okay. Oh, nice. Witsiv is great. Let's try this one. Let's try this one out. We will get 6,000 dice. I mean, 6,000 points. And therefore, well, it's the same amount of coins as if I did easy mode with most of the qualifiers. But it's neither here nor there. Okay, we want that. We want that right now. Okay, this is actually a really good starting hand. Put in Chongyun first. Cool. That's... Bitter Belligerence. Gurgling Bubble. So it's all about finding a way to ensure that they all stay frozen. Oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, okay. Affected, afflicted by Frozen Gurgling Bubble. One Chonghua Frostfield. Let's go for that. Could we use a resonance? I guess we could. But let's not overplay our hand. Just cryo slime. But let's use a leave it to me. Make sure that nobody has elements on them. Make sure nobody has any elements on them for as long as possible. Oh, but I I needed to put that on him. Whatever. And will that freeze you? That will freeze you. Can they be... Oh, but they can't be... Oh, that's right. They... It's immune to Frozen 2. I'm stupid. Wait, wait. It's triggering the Frozen reaction, so it's... Actually, as dumb as it sounds... We are going to go with a DPS Nilu here. We're just going to have Nilu not even doing any blooms, just attacking with a sword and using her skill. And that's how we're going to get this done. Because the fact that Xing Chao self applies Hydro is ruining this, because I didn't really read that closely, and well, I thought that maybe even if. Cryo slimes were immune to being frozen in the normal game. Maybe they weren't here, but no, it's the same as normal, and I'm an idiot. Okay, Chongyun and two girl bosses. Okay, let's do this. Try this again. Yes. These are somewhat okay. Okay, and we got. We got no Ellen here. That's the important thing. Since we have that, that's fine. So we can let pretty much anyone get hit by Cryo, as long as they don't get by hit by Hydro. Oh, that's good. And you're using it on Wanderer, right? Is that right? Let's just see. Alright. Put that on you. How many can I afford to... I can... Probably afford to put this down, maybe? Can I? Let's think. If I put this, put that on. Ah, uh, no, I can't actually afford to put the parametric down. If I did, I wouldn't be able to use. One, two. Yeah, I couldn't do that. Can't do that this round. Okay. Oh, but I'm gonna have to. Let's think. Let's think about this one. So oh, nice. Oh, R4 too. That's good. Especially if we get lucky. Let's see. Get a bit more by way of... Put on you, actually. And... Two. I have one to use... Frozen, but that won't do much. And now we can hit the Hydro Slime and freeze it. There we go. Okay. Didn't have to do all that much. 
ending O, but the... Oh, no. That... That caused an issue. She's just going to get frozen first thing next round. Wait. Oh, that... Wait, so... Since those cryo slimes are immune to being frozen... Oh, that... Let's play this out. This this is gonna be kind of painful. So what team did he use besides that Yonfei then? Yeah, see, she's frozen now. She'll be frozen next round too. So that was not as easy as I predicted it being. Hmm. So actually it wouldn't be let me think. D Luke maybe? Yeah, I think it might be Diluc. Because since those cryo slimes can't be frozen, I need a way to knock them down. Straight from full. And I need Diluc for that. Let's see. Oops, temper. Difficulty. My deck. A Chongyun and a Diluc. We have all Yanfei, Tanari, and Zhao. Okay. I was wondering, because you said you were using Yanfei, whether you got someone applying. Hydro for her to vaporize. Hey, sorry. No Nilu. Wait, so... Someone off field, maybe? No, no, no. A swirl could maybe be nice. No, I don't think so. Maybe a Dia. I don't know. This is... Decent. Let me think. That would... One slot. Flying Flame could be good. So I'd be able to use it a decent amount of times. Nobody's Hydro anymore. Let's actually put... Probably not going to be able to benefit from Gamblers, given how many there are, so let's just put Crimson there. Put in a couple of Resonances. I... I'm not smart enough to lose hope in you. That's what I'll say. If you feel insulted by that, maybe you should be. Let's just... Oh, actually, maybe I should switch some of these out. Right, this Paimon card is good, too. Do I really need those switches? Uh -huh. Let's try this again. Let's try this silly deck again. Okay. Ice Cold Dominance, and we start with Shangyun. These are okay. It's per round switch. This is this is fine. This is tolerable. Yeah. More or less. Huh. Who am I going to? How am I gonna make this work? Maybe if I could manage to burst one down, grab one. That could help. Who knows? Okay. Try this out, and... Sure. Let's try this. Freeze you. Strong Walk Ross Field. That said, having a talent there would be quite nice. I said that, but then I got hungry. Ikoka. Ikoka. Hmm. There's a skill and not been frozen. Let's just do that then. Equip this to your active deal loop. If I wanted to, I could probably actually eliminate one. But. Oh, well. Yeah, if I'd used a fast action, I could have actually completely eliminated one of those cryo slimes. This. This is gonna hurt me. On a spiritual level. Let's move that Catherine out of the way. Oh. Uh, uh. Yep. Has not been affected by Frozen, but they're immune to Frozen. This... This is going to be tough. I do feel like getting... Maybe putting in Sucrose could be good. Well, that's because you haven't played Dark Souls. If you tried out Dark Souls, God knows what would happen. 
Not sure I want to. If you're gonna play mean, I can play mean. Okay, so we've actually got a decent amount in here. Let's try this. Hmm. What am I gonna do? Gonna, oh, I can actually get that. That's good. Come on. Well, this may be the end of our, the end of our conflict. If this was a peaceful resolution, I can't say I'm entirely disappointed. So actually, could I get rid of one of them? Hopefully, get rid of one of them. Take two. Two. Yeah, if a, a lot of this is just, I'm not getting very good, very good rolls here. You're gonna hit me, you're gonna freeze me, but... Uh, uh, it's... Yeah, I... I might just try using Animo again, honestly. Let's see if that team I used before will work. Venti, Sucrose, Gene 1. Because there are only three rounds. So I really need to be fast. And the best way to do spread damage is, of course, it's going to be Animo. Frozen. Uh, uh. Well, I'm glad you enjoy it. Let's see. I can't. I can't freeze them though, so this is so so weird. Okay, so they're gonna switch, they're gonna run, they're gonna switch. It's all about finding a way to freeze, switch, freeze, switch. Okay. Well use Sucrose's skill. Some of you all around them. Maybe I could keep Diluc in to just eliminate the cryo slimes once that's all done. Possibly. Either way, that's good damage. It's quite good damage. Frozen reaction. Gonna switch again? You are just going to switch again. Okay. Fine. But it's just. What are you doing? What are you actually doing? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, you're just switching. It's nonsense. I guess I could just... <laughs> well... And this... Starting with the Hydro Slime is what, what's really messing me up. Because if I could... Maybe what I should have done is... Maybe one cryo character, one animo character, one pyro character. Pyro character just clean things up at the end, and then... Cry to freeze the first one, switch out, freeze the others with some hydro cryo swirls. It's... Ah, there's so many moving parts. So many moving parts to all this. That's the thing. Well... Huh. It's getting kind of crazy, honestly. Well, whatever. We're gonna move again, we're gonna... God knows what. Hydro Slime, that's just one. I don't need the large Wind Spirit, though. Need is... Huh. Well... This is so silly. So silly. Could try... Putting it down, maybe? No, to what, baby girl? Okay, so that dealt a good amount of damage, but none of them are frozen. Because they were so insistent, if they had... And they probably plotted out their AI this way, deliberately. But... The brute fact... The brute fact that I can't switch them to that cryo slime and have that cryo slime do an attack so I can screw off it, it just kept switching back to the hydro slime. 
is what really caused me issues here. So can I move this round? Can I move it all this round? So it would be really funny if I could just continue swirling and get everything down that way. It's trying to hurt me. It's all it's doing. Let's actually do a bit of switching around. Or I could have just done some strategic switching. That's also true. Let's go into the cryo slime. Freeze both of them now. So this is what I really had to do, I guess. Hi. There's both of you. Cool. Switch. You're gonna switch again, or...? No, you're just declaring the end of your round. Oh, nice. Good luck with that. So a bit of strategic switching might have... might actually have done it. Interesting. Well, okay. Hmm. Alright then. Alright then. What can I use? If I use all these, I could put her burst down. Okay. So I'm figuring things out. Slowly but surely. But it's the healing there. That's the issue. But if they're not frozen, it's not yet been afflicted. So they shouldn't get healed. Shouldn't get healed. Wouldn't think. Well, whatever. Let's try this out again. Well, we'll see. We'll see. It's just... Freezing could allow me to deal good damage to... Some of those guys, but... Yeah, now all of them are frozen. But I'm not gonna be able to do this in time. Mm -hmm. Out of their round... Another freeze... Well, the way I do it is... Wait, that's not great. Mm -hmm. Two physical... Oh, I could actually just... Oh, the physical would work better. That's what I should have been doing. Whatever. Goodbye. Goodbye. So I got close. Very narrow. Very narrowly a failure. Hmm. Interesting. Let's try this again. I would say I use Bennett because he can more or less stay in place as a ranged character. It's something like Zhongli, Bennett, Farzan. That's what I would go for. You really do ideally want to be using Bennett. Storm Zone? Okay, actually that could be good. Storm Zone could be good by letting me switch switch around. Iridescence could too. Oh, okay. In that case. In that case, I'm not sure. We need to make a Storm Zone. So, yeah, that would be nice because it would allow us to switch around a lot more. Hmm. But. But. Make sure the right characters take the right hits. Well, Gene, I guess, maybe, if he really needs the battery, but he's his damage isn't very burst-reliant. That's the thing. Okay, equip. Probably equip you too. Then, pull off the storm zone. Cool. Get a lot of dice that way. Cool. Alright. Switch. Disable. Okay, I'm gonna switch over and then go for a normal actually. It's just the cryo slime and on one next. So I could actually get an okay amount off, probably. Okay, but, but, wait, wait. How do I wanna do this? It'd be one and then you'd switch. Switch, who do you switch to? Do you have to do these in sequence? I think you do. I think you are gonna stay in sequence. Switch to the Hydra Slime. Switch to the Cryo Slime. So actually, I can very much abuse this. Uh -huh. Okay. Lovely. Switch to the Cryo Slime and... Well, I can't take that, but... That's kind of going to go to waste. But we're jamming. Okay. So actually, what I want to do is find a way to... Yeah, actually, keeping the 
Cryo Slime's alive a bit longer might be a good thing, because it'll allow me to continue freezing. That could work. The big thing is just, besides the healing, I'm not sure what she would contribute to that team specifically. My vote does remain for Bennett, frankly. For sure. Okay, so then I need a way to deal with Cryo Slimes. This... This is fine, though. It's gonna kill the Hydro ones pretty easily, and then actually maybe a Hydro DPS at the end to get a lot of dice by freezing. Possibly. Either way, we can just spam these. Really nothing is lost. Okay. And we go over, we do this. Cool. Xingqiao, Bennett, Farzan, and... Oh, interesting. Switch again. Yep, you are. Nice. Yeah, just go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> there we go. Thank you, Supros. Joe Bennett, Farzan. Yeah, that would work. You can get a decent amount of value out of Xing Chao. Yelon works too if you have Yelon. His addition to Hadra application that he can swirl for a bit more time in the air. He also just gets the damage bonus, and that's good too. But in the end, it's not that complicated or that deep. Okay, so Swirl, you're gonna ram me, and I can just go for more. Okay, you're at 10. This shouldn't be trouble to deal with. Okay. 3-3-3 three, three, three will do it. I can just freeze them all. I'm getting really lucky rolls with the amount of Animo dice I'm getting, too. Okay, there we go. First of the switch. We'll go back. Get another frozen. It really is that easy. If you want to beat this on hard mode, this is all you have to do. No joke. It doesn't even matter who's in here. It's just Venti to hopefully help out a little. And if you're, I have been getting lucky rolls. But still, it's, yeah. it's nothing too crazy. Okay, there we are. Frankly, what I could be using, I could have put an animal resonance. Didn't think about it, but that would have been good too. Let's put down the butterfly. So, there we go. Cool. So we got three out of the four done. Please do, I'm interested. Yeah, but sh yeah, Xing Chao is a pretty good choice. Works well with- oh! But, in that case, you would want to use normals instead of charge attacks, but I'm sure you know that already. Last one is- oh, it's more of this. Ruinous competition. Multiply damage. Features by one. An action card. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Let's just think. Plus 30 HP. That would be 50. Got four rounds for this. Huh, action card. So actually, talents increases by one. Three times per round. One Omni die. So using talents would really, really help. Actually, the d deck I'd want to make. So let's actually just. I should have erased one, but whatever. Just. Toss it out. Characters, you can deal lots of pyro damage quickly and easily. So that would be... Probably... Let's see. Yonfei, Kui, Diluc. It's simple, but... And all of them have talent cards that allow them to just use a skill basically for free, given that they're getting a bit of... getting an Omni die back, and it isn't actually any higher cost than it normally is, and if we want to be really funny, we could put Storm Terror's Lair in, and I could use it even more easily, so that's what I'll do. It's a description of this anyway. I gotta take a quick bathroom break. I'll Be right back, drink a bunch of water again.
Okay, I'm back. But isn't that how you're supposed to do it in South Italy anyway? The spaghetti alla assassina? I saw something about that. Okay. So, Pyro Resonance for sure. The purposely burnt spaghetti. The spaghetti that you scorch a little so it gets a little brown crust. And spaghetti... I think that's how you spell it. I saw some videos about that. It's apparently a very, very, very local cuisine. But it's supposed to be a real thing. I would think. Okay, Ellen for sure. No, not Liban. Probably not Liban. Parametric. Definitely. Vonorana probably. Let's see. Probably. Definitely Crimson. Def Crimson. What else, what else could I? Mm. Just lots of sack on everyone. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Sacrificial fragments. Yeah. Well, it was they. Sh they said it was the assassin spaghetti, which isn't entirely a, isn't entirely a correct reading of it if I recall correctly but I would trust you on this subject more than anyone else hmm, hmm. I don't want to do this then. more cards maybe Shh, maybe maybe this might actually this might be good too let's see okay there we go let's try this deck out um, okay. Let's see. Oh. Because you, but you burn them a little, right? Deliberately. And you basically fry it. I think. 60 HP, baby. 60 HP. Let's do this thing. Okay. So, I kind of knew what I was talking about. Kinda. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Let's think. Swing Onslaught. Random talent card from your deck. Many do I want to? Oh. So I did get a die from that. Let's put down... Could we put down Ellen? I'm gonna put down... I don't do Luke and then think. Think about this. Put. Mm, mm, let's think. One. Not to a might actually. So I don't want to use too many cards because I might not get another. And I need to make sure that multiplied damage goes away. Which one would I want to use? Okay, actually, it would be this one. This one. Is that one. Wait, no, but that would... No, this would be... This would perfectly consume everything. Interesting. Do you mean pasta that isn't burned or pasta that's straight up cold? So waltz. Overwhelming. Okay, well... Do that, but... Oh, wait. Okay. Guess we have a die gone then. Okay. Wait. Well. All right. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do now? Hmm. Interesting. I can I can sympathize with that to an extent. I don't necessarily need things to be totally heated up. Two piercing ice ridge. So that's gonna kill, but. Swing onslaught. Then we go for dawn, probably. Okay. Click that. 
going to die. Good amount of damage. And then we... Oh, but that... Let's pretend that didn't happen. Can I? Oh, but you can't rewind or anything. I needed to use more cards. I'm stupid. Let's try that again. Just need to use a bunch of cards at the start so that he doesn't... So that it doesn't just do more damage to you. Got five rounds for this, I think. Something like that. We'll see. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. Alright. Alright. Let's go for it. Yeah, let's just go for it. Can't kill me round it can't kill me round one, I don't think. I am counting on that. Hmm. Use those on you, possibly. Use that on somebody else who will just die this room, maybe. Well, okay. Then maybe sack on you. Ofer. Take two. Get how many die from that? Actually, let's plus three damage. Use them right now. Okay, this should be good. Should be pretty good. Yep, okay, nine. Good stuff. Oh, but right, Sack gave me a bit more. That, that's okay. Mm. More about using them one way, or, one way or another than anything else. Cool. In my round then. Okay. Live your burst, then I die. So we ought to think about this one. I have to think about this one. Live your burst, die. Hmm. I want to use this, but hmm. should probably get some kind of card draw effect. Eh, we'll see. Then use another die, probably. Yeah. Go for one. Big hit. You will barely not kill me. Then I'll go for a burst. Okay. Cool. Interesting. Metal deal closest to your current active character. Oh, so that would hit Yanfei. That's certainly something. Hit. Oh, there we go. We deal 11 damage. Cool. <laughs> Can't hate that. Mm -hmm. Hit me. Send in Klee. Okay. Well, one pyro damage, but we should be okay. Got a few more rounds for all this. Alright. How many more action cards we got in the tank? How many more action cards we got in the tank? Jumpy Dumpty. Defeated in this round. Oh, that might be bad news. Let's see. For a Jumpy Dumpty. Hmm. Jumpy Dumpty once. Explosive Spark. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Give me. On me. To find damage stacks. Gonna hit me, gonna hit me. Okay, well we can do that. Here we go again, we'll play this. Go for a little bit more. Hi. Cool. Then, and there we go, there we go. Seal of approval once. Okay. Charge attack with six or less HP. Shack with it equipped. Cool. What am I going to be able to do as a result of this? Can I, oh, goodness. Yeah, I'm undead. And that was so close, too. Hmm. Hmm. It's just, I need... Some kind of card draw effect is gonna really help with this. In that case. Jump plus two. Yeah, it's just... Uh, all right. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay. 
That's a real crying shame. Actually, maybe. Maybe what I should be doing... Maybe I could use Dia. Uh... Uh... thing about it, though, is that she doesn't really have good sources of damage. The issue is that I just wasn't getting enough of the right cards. And not enough cards in general, because you need three every time. Some kind of card draw effect would be nice. In that case, actually, what I should be putting on that is not Crimson, but Gilded. Oh, but three different types. Uh, uh, okay. Got a good amount of cards in hand. That might make a real difference. Hopefully. Let's hope. Hmm. Who could I get rid of? Wouldn't really miss. That's... That one wasn't working out because the death timings weren't lining up all that well. This... This could hopefully work. Let's see. Let's just hit, hit, hit until the enemy dies while I die too. But... But... Let me think about this. Hmm. It's the Claymore. Hmm. Let me think about this one. Claymore is good, but I might want to save it to an extent. Not equip it too quickly. So the more cards I get, the more dice I can get by playing cards. That is the secret. Let's put this on you. Put that on you. Get another die. Get one of those, maybe. Let's think. Put on you. Okay. Put that on D Luke. And then. Can, yeah, we can use a Scarlet Seal. And use a charge attack. Okay. So I got up to how many times? Up to two times. Okay. Did get a bit of foreign flame from that too. Okay. Brilliance. Scarlet Seal and Brilliance. We can deal a bit of extra damage there. Lose a bit, but... Oh my goodness. Some icicles outside my room just fell down. Okay. Yep, we're getting a good amount of cards to play. Cool. And this should work decently enough, I hope. We'll see. Survive one hit and then... Blast with another charge attack, hopefully. We'll see. Hmm. Alright, alright. Figure this one out. Who do I want to... Who do I want to equip? That is... Truly the question. I suppose I could put... Some on Diluc. Put down Ellen, maybe. And then... Another Kid Kujirai. And all that's basically free. Okay, cool. Then we use another Burst, and... Either go for another 3, or... Another, another Burst. Then we hit with... Oh, but it didn't have the... No, that's just overwhelming ice. Good. The ice Shards, thanks. Plus 2 for one of these, and we're more or less good to go. Cool. Just like that. But who do I want to actually attack with? There's nobody I could... Actually, I could put down... I could put down Tenshikaku. And that would be good to have, just for its own sake. Closest, so who would that count as? I guess prioritizes active character otherwise, probably. Probably. Mm. All right. Let's just keep on going. Spike shot and see how long Dio can keep going here. I set him up a decent amount, so we'll see. That down on one, then give Clea sack fragments, and that might help. Might be able to get this done. So okay, yep, and we got a bit of extra dice, good stuff. Snack frags on Klee, Hot Rodai. 
Power die, and that should keep things good. That got rid of... Did that not get rid of multiplied damage? Oh no, but it will once I play Flowing Flame. Okay. Hopefully this will work. Hopefully this will all work. Not sure. We'll see. Got a bit of extra dice. Ice Ring Waltz. One damage. Three. Oh, that. Death approaches. All right. For one more. Nine. Okay. And we got a bit more out of that. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Actually, what I could do. No, no. I could switch and then... Don't have enough dice in that case. Which would deal more? Eight or... Mm, yeah, I shouldn't waste. Okay. Mm. Alright. He gets rid of that. Now all I can really do is... Well... Let's think. The lack of healing is actually causing some issues. I have quickly come to realize that I really should have in some healing. Oh, but if I if I keep my turn going for too long, it'll attack first and just wipe me out with multiplied damage. Okay, that that's interesting. There's no one I can really just use as a sacrificial lamb. That's gonna kill me. Yep. Okay. This is a really, really hard fight, actually. Trying to figure out who I, should, who I should actually use. Just so dealing more hits. What should be done is actually fewer hits with more damage. However, that's going to work. So I take the if I keep the turn going too long, the hypostasis will move before me. Oh my goodness. Were you playing it on phone, tablet, PC, console? Oh, okay. How new is your phone? Just wondering. Well, how old is your phone? Because I don't get crashes. It might, well... How high are graphic settings? Not K. Because my graphic settings have all, on phone for all have always been at absolute minimum, and I've never experienced a crash. So actually, putting food in here would be pretty good. These are actually bad. We don't want more attacks. What we want, we want food. Let's just think this through. What foods should we use? This... maybe. Lotus Flower Crisp is always good. And possibly... Some level die. To HP Matsutake is good too. Still, that's way more often than I would expect. I feel like, in that case, it might be a hardware issue specifically, or maybe a settings issue. Yeah, an iPad, you're, the iPad is, as in, the model's three years old, or you've been personally using it for three years? Hmm. Let's think this through. Let's think this through. How many should I use? Who should I use? That, it's not too great to have right now. Kusharai, maybe, okay. Let's try this out. Actually, let's actually just go for Dialog right now. Hmm. Ellen could be useful at the very end. That's about it. Yeah, that... That would do it. That would definitely do it. Hmm. Who do I want to... Kujirai? Kujirai is nice to have. But who... These are not a great set of starting cards. Not gonna be able to 
Got a lot of hits in here. That sucks. Oh, whatever. Okay. Yeah. For lack of a better term, I'd say in character. Okay. No, I could have left that. I should have left that. Okay. Well, hmm. let's see if this works out. I am frightened. Oh, oh, you're suggesting that I send Kalyan first? That's probably a good idea. Because if I got her burst off, it would deal a good amount of damage to itself. Yeah. Tell me to play more TCG. You might get more of that. Okay, right, because... Zack, what uses a skill to pyro damage to active? That's what I should be doing. That's exactly what I should be doing. Actually, what I really could have been doing, should have been doing, is... <sighs> could have put star signs in to get Klee up faster. Thank you for the advice. Then I'd be able to vaporize without needing to worry about getting a bunch of pyro dice up. I'm so dumb. Okay. Well, I could put that down. That down. Okay, I'll try again. I'll see how this one goes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. Can you hit me again? Maybe I'll try to... Possibly... Oh, no! But we got a good amount from that, too. Maybe go for a... First, just for more damage? Yeah, probably. Okay. Like that. Hit you like that. Pikmin 4. Yeah, Pikmin. I don't dislike Pikmin. Okay, and now you're on field. Cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't want to put in now. I could just go for another... Another one there. Oh, I... Wait, I thought I put Kui in. I'm so dumb. Yeah, this is lost. This is over. Okay. Fair. Okay, let's try putting in Klee first. See what that does. Because that would... Could be useful there. Let's see. Not that for now. Who do I want to put in? Tenchukaku is good. Tenchukaku is always good. Today got the Tsudaya. How do I want to go about this? How do I want to go about this? Good amount of stuff. Okay, what are you? Probably that there. Can I get out this way? And I need one more. Can I be able to get a jumpy dumpty down, maybe? Let's think about this. I actually don't probably don't want that up there. Maybe. Actually, if all I want to do is get the burst off, get the burst off this way, first thing next round, and then just have other people come in and do stuff, this could work. Possibly. Let's think. Spark uses just one. Spend one less pyro. Okay. Hmm. There we go, and if we're really lucky, we could get the burst off too. Let's think. Okay. Oh, but I'm not actually. Well, let me think. Okay, one more, one more. Go, we got that. And we can leave that next round. We can... Okay, first thing we'll do, use the burst. Alright. Okay. Thank you for the suggestion. I think we may be in business. Possibly. Alright. Alright. Klee, Klee, Klee. My goodness. Me when Klee mechanics. Put that on Klee. There's another one on someone else. Got somebody expendable. We'll see. One Sparks and Splash. Probably. Well, Klee's dead. Klee's very, very dead now. But, it's a free switch. Cool. Who do I want to put in now? I guess I could put in Diluc, maybe? We'll see. Sure. Is the best nuke. There we go, we get a bit of extra 
Do damage that way. Down. We go for one of these. Okay, cool. Nice. Gonna get out of that. We can use another maybe. Ha. Huh. Complicated. Complicated situation. Rest in peace, Kui. Necessary sacrifice. Hmm. Get another. We could hopefully nuke down the rest of the way with... Maybe... A Dealic Burst that I can hopefully get, and then... Yanfei. Let's see. Depends on the cards I get. Oh, bad news. Bad news. I'm probably dead. Okay. Prayers, prayers, prayers. It depends on what ends up getting used, but so much of this is honestly just roll luck. Okay, what are you going to use? Oh, well, I'm dead either way. Okay. Hmm. Noctua, Flame Flame. I'm not going to get his burst. That's the tragedy. Okay. That'll kill me, and I'm probably screwed. Oh my goodness. When did I get any cards? No, I didn't get any card from that. Well, whatever. Ah, uh, such is life. Such is life. Give me... Give me some more. Actually, is this... Wait. No, no, no. One, one, five, oh. Oh. That was so close, too. But now I'm dead. Okay, if I get luckier, I could hopefully get that down. It does seem like Kui, start, starting off with Kui, is definitely going to be the way to go. Let's see. <laughs> Kill is okay. Kill it is okay. Maybe I could keep that in there. Possibly. Let's think about this one. I have the opposite. Okay. Let's keep on going. Try this out. If anyone at Mahoyo is watching, it's not to help me. Certainly not. We can get a few more cards this way. Change a few things around, maybe. Okay, put down Kujirai, probably. Okay. Then play a Jumpy Dumpty. Cool. And that will remove the overall whatever. I mean, the multiplied damage. Okay. And we go for another one of these. Go for a Kaboom. Do the damage and... Okay. Good amount of stuff, so we can send a duke after this, maybe. Definitely actually might use that on him to make sure he can stay alive to use a burst. We'll see. But now we can sack Klee and use her burst next time. Cool. So I've got next round in my hand. A couple of those. That healing could be okay. Maybe. We'll see. Either way, let's hope we get good dice, like the time with the net. That's... it's serviceable. Okay. But, we're sacking Klee, so... We don't need to wait all that long. Okay. Let's just 
Use this, right? We can sack. What else do we want to... What else do we want to use? Two Tenshikakus, maybe? Yeah, it's just... Put down two of those, maybe. Actually, put down one. Use reverse. That'll sack Klee. But, thank you, thank you. So, what should I use next? Okay, probably got a bit of healing up on him. I... whatever happens, happens. <sighs> Let's see, how many more do I need to play? I guess I could... do I need the healing right now? I could use the healing right now. I'll use that healing right now. Hmm. I guess maybe I could use that, just use another card. It's... I... It's both. It really is. But... There are only so many things I can do. I... To a certain point, you always have to accept... Can't really control. There are things in life that can't really be controlled. I'll say that much. So we've got a good setup of cards for next round. Hmm. Let's keep on going. Hmm. Okay. I'm going and... This... It's not an amazing set of cards, but what I really needed was... Okay, right, that's going to deal three either way, so I can completely negate that without any waste by playing that now. Should I? I'll play that. And play... I could just play that again. Just won't be any use for it after. She would probably bind it eventually. So may as well play it now. We'll use maybe the Paimon card later, possibly. We'll see. A bit more down, and then maybe I could... Am I going to be able to use this burst? I don't know. I need a lot of dice for that. Actually, I'll be barely able to use that burst. That would deal... How many? Deal 10 damage. That's good. That is quite good. Let's actually just switch that out. Turn that there, and we can use this burst. 10 damage, easy. I should be able to win next round.
we should do it. I'm gonna try to be quieter, but she's probably gonna keep complaining anyway. <laughs> It's just... What do you even do? What do you even do after a certain point? It's just... She very plainly... We haven't had a positive interaction in months. It's honestly kind of insane. But it's whatever. Two, two, two. Okay. Let's play this. Well, maybe. It depends. Yeah. Well, you know, that's like. Oh, I didn't know it revived. That's funny. It's back with four? Maybe. How many does it have left? Let's see. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, this will do it. Good. And there we go. That's the end of that card on Hypostasis. Thank you for the tips and the support, moral and otherwise. That's just... Can you meaningfully hear me right now? Is this enough to hear? It's just... Can't talk in a normal tone of voice, but I don't want to whisper. I wouldn't want to just be silent either. But it's just... Okay, good. Should I turn the mic off, or... It's just... Okay, good. It's just... Okay, thank you. Let's just try this. Oh, if you wanted to, we could... You could play me. <laughs> Anyone on US server could go for a round. That would work. But... That said, it would raise the question of screen sheet. Oh, nice! 9-3 in Abyss. Proud of you. Let's keep on going. Nine. Oh, nine two. Okay. Let's try this out. Jean. Oh, that'll do it. What level is she? Hmm. So who should I put in? Barb is okay. Eleven. Oh, nice. And that's who's in eleven three right now. Forget. One side was mirror mate. Oh, yeah. In that case, it's definitely a kind of a durability issue. I had that issue when I was trying to run her before. This could maybe be okay. Let's try this out. Ayaka and Changyun. Who else then? Who else? Maybe Hydro. No, not Hydro. Who could I make work? Dory got. No, oh, but they took Toma. Oh, goodness. It's like a bit of an Let's try this one out. Okay. Because <sighs> before I used the Zhao team this time, I tried out Farzan in Abyss before I had even fully leveled her up. Which meant that I really had to be good at dodging. She could take one hit before dying, but two from pretty much anything would be guaranteed death. I was trying this at level 22 or something. It was kind of ludicrous. Okay, okay, definitely want Sataria, Sataria? Mm, ah, no, no Sataria. This is gonna be useful though. It's definitely gonna be useful. Maybe have someone take. Let's see what dice I get. Support zone, discard from support zone. Ah, oh, not gonna get that many of those. Let's try this out. See so if I can put some buffs on Ayaka. Good stuff on Ayaka. And turn three of those into a sword, and that's good. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Let's try this out. Okay, so I could get Content Senyo on one of them. But, oh, uh, Content Senyo and. Definitely want to put this on Aika, but no, it's. They, do they know it's their turn? Okay, cool. Good. It'd be really funny if they didn't, but. Hmm. No, no, no. This is what kind of work. Oh, I picked Yao Yao because she was my lowest con level. We weigh... We weigh four star. But... All the options are pretty good. Are they gonna try to overload me, maybe? Let's see. By the way, Libin will help. 
Because I thought about trying to get another Gaum in Constellation, but a C3 isn't all that relevant. And that's that where it would have taken me. My Gauming is C2 right now. Which is a decent level. It does mean he has more energy issues than he would at C4. If he had been at C3, I might have gone for the C4, even though Yano is still C1, just for the energy help, but still. Well, it makes sense. They're the newest, they're not in Star Glitter Shop, and... They're, they aren't on banners all that often in Yayo's case. Yayo has, if I recall correctly, literally only been on banners with... Literally only been on banners with Alhatham for some reason. Which is really, really weird for them to be joined. I don't know. It's just kind of strange. So I should just have Chongun and Ayaga try to knock a few down, then see if I can have Zhongli kind of cheese it. We'll see. Let's go for the CF. And we did get Chongyuns, so that's good. Usu energy, that's pretty alright. Jet's not all that useful or necessary, sadly, but... Okay. Fusion... That's alright. That case. Let's change that with Jet, and oh, but I can't actually... Oh, right, I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. There. Chilling in C6 is pretty interesting, I'll say that much. But oh, goodness. And that... I can get the field up, but that... Wasn't ideal. Okay. okay. In that case, we've gotten that down. Who do we switch to now? Oh. Oh, C0? That's surprising. The funny thing about Xingqiao C0 is that Xingqiao straight up... Oh, probably gonna go for the overload. Xingqiao legitimately his his splash art actually is not his splash art doesn't reflect his C0 state, it reflects his C1 state because it has four swords, not, not three okay, I would say so Xingqiao is always good. His C6 is really good, too. So if you have a chance to get him, you should take advantage of it. Hmm. Let's see. What do I go for? I might have lost this already. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Let's think about this. Let's knock him down. And we already got that. Who should I try using? Try... Oh, uh, use a skill switch into the next to be active. That could be alright. Maybe I'll use that. Put that on you. Then... Play that. Try to switch over to Zhongli, maybe. Maybe. Depends on how many. Let's go for that. So Zhongli... Then actually go for... The shield. Let's see. Slap it as striking stone, plus one geo damage. Hmm. Or shield. Zal's revised exactitude. Okay. In that case, we use that to switch that and we play. That that deals a good amount of damage too. The nice thing is that Zhongli can actually cheese a few things. Are they gonna pay attention to that? Okay. They are going to take notice of that. Probably go for a Actually, no. We can be funny. We can be funny with it. Do that, why don't you? You're gonna try to use an electro charge reaction. I'm not going to let you do that. I'm not gonna let you do that. Okay. And now, next turn. Cool. My round. It's gonna heal that back. Get more energy, too. Oh, I think they're gonna go for the heal. Don't like that. Oh, but actually. No, you aren't. Maybe get another one in, and then we sack, maybe we go in, we send an Ayaka, and have fun. Let's see. A little bit of that. A little bit of that. Go for another. Oh, maybe we could... F could we freeze? Yeah, we could freeze. Okay. 
Shinchan's outfit is a lot of fun. I especially like that it more than slightly resembles... More than slightly resembles... Furina's outfit. It's cute. Pretty silly, too. Let's go for the Chongma. What are we going to be able to do? Come on, come on. First, two, that in. Cool. So the right Seno. Then go for four. Thank you, thank you. Can I hit me or are you going to switch? You hit me. Got a Zhongli. Oh, actually, well, that's fine. Interesting. You're actually going for the Electro Charge, which is actually better for me. You made a real fool of yourself. Okay. Hmm. Let's actually just go for the burst next time. I would say you are. There have been some other people coming in, or coming in and out, but only one person requested I start a fan cord. So I would say that's true. You can take pride in that. Yeah. You can you can fight it about amongst yourselves over which one of you is more dedicated. But I don't think that would be a particularly productive battle. <laughs> number one and number two. That order is... Are you tied for number one? Maybe you're actually tied for number two and the spot of number one is empty. Actually, maybe... Wait. Maybe number one is the director. Or maybe number zero is the director. It's like the Fatui. They are taking their sweet time with this. Are they gonna forget? Did they kind of think that they messed this up, maybe? Oh, they might be trying to decide whether to let Crystallize, sack somebody. Zero. Okay. Piero. Exactly. You made the fan You requested the fan court and set up the channels. How brutal. Not the college bigotry. Am I going to lose this? Am I going to win by timeout? Or are they trying to stall me deliberately? That'd be so funny. Let's see. Tick down, tick down, tick down. I'm ending my round. I must be hearing a tick down or something. Let's see. Oh, it just declares the end of the round. So I suppose they were just maliciously wasting my time. I'm... Well, for what it's worth, I've said this already. I'm 22. Graduated from college last spring and... I looked for jobs, but instead I got a parasite. Oh, okay, okay. I wasn't exactly sure. Go, and they've actually got the infusion still up. So having Jean Lee there helps. So we just let Chong Yun kind of get sacked while we equipped Ayaka. Well, the worms seem to be more or less gone. Which helps some things. So they don't automatically lose, they just... Okay. You're in a much better state for state than them. They've got a total of 5 HP, we've got a total of 15. Yeah, doesn't change the fact that I'll still probably... I might still have some, I don't know. The worms will probably be a trademark in the sense of... Oh, are they just going for the burst now? Congratulations. You can finally drink in America. I know you could argue that for five years in Italy. Maybe, maybe. At this point, we're just kind of... We're sharing room at this point. Okay. Let's keep on going. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. And yeah, the force is user burst. Oh, well, that changed the equation. You're actually in somewhat better position than me now. In that case, actually... How do I want to do this? Maybe I'd like to use up as much of the infusion as possible, maybe. <laughs> What do you mean, assuming what? Oh, well, okay. Me when you're up. So who's next? Who's gonna come in next? Should I... Sataria? Not that good. So we can just eliminate Barbara permanently that way. Cool. Yeah. Well, exactly. Wait, so what's the drinking age in Europe again? Is it 16 or... What? Who's next? Are you gonna... If you'll hit me, and then I can probably just send Zhongli. 
Actually, no, but I will have a little bit left by way of shield and all. She'll probably be able to survive, but she'll actually get moved. Which is actually good for me. I would say somewhere between 15 and 25. I don't know for sure. Does anyone know for sure? Who knows? Okay, hit me, hit me, hit me. Shield, deal one damage, a shield bonus. Let's see. Oh, okay. And, oh! Oh, right, different set of artifacts. Let's discover this then. Let's see. That, more. Nice. Wait, so. Is that. Put that on you. Change that into. Also. Five insufficient petrification. How am I gonna do this then? Oh, yeah. Makes sense. Oh, it is? Oh, well, to be fair, most American high school kids drink it before somehow anyway. That's... that's life. So we can petrify. That example. Well, there, there are people who... do stuff with their dr drink and family settings with parents and the like. It's decently normal, I would say. Have a, have a better opinion of yourself as a European. Yeah, I... This is gonna sound really, really silly, but legitimately... Legitimately, it was a lot more interesting when it was illegal. Okay. Not to... Tr yeah, wine? Wine tastes good. Honestly, a lot of it is just taste one way or the other. So how much damage are you gonna be able to deal to me? How can I survive this? It's getting down to the wire. Two tall pole arm users up against each other. It's going to be all be about what I managed to roll. If I can get his shield up, I should be good. Let's see. Definitely you're going to go for blazing blessing, but there's only so much you can do against me. So that's champagne, right? This Monte? I think that's what you'd be referring to. Yep, exactly. Full damage. Can't really mimic that. So then we go for that. Four Geo damage. Thank you, Vortex Vanquisher. Okay. Have you told me this before? I feel like I should remember more. Oh, okay. So it's basically Italian champagne in a certain sense, maybe. Who knows? Okay. There we go. We won that one. People could. But. Those people would be French, so how much do we mind? So we've completed one. Let's match and do another. If you wanted to, maybe Kay and I could try a match. But. Okay. Fair. You're, a very t you're, you're very tolerant for an Italian. I'll pick one that. I want to kind of ruin a synergy, maybe. Let's think about this. Just these characters kind of suck. I could find a way to guarantee a reaction. So I could monopolize danger one way or another. Exactly. You're a very tolerant Italian. And I appreciate that about you. Dory. So in that case, how should I? Hmm. Let's think about this. So a healer could be nice. Actually, uh, maybe I'll put in fake babble and one ill pearl seahorse. I've never actually used pearl seahorse though. I don't want to do this. Do I want to do this? Oh, but seahorse's whole deal is that it, it's more resistant to summons, which could help with Dory, but it depends on what the other side actually uses. Okay, Gene. Okay. The duel is about to begin. Let's see how this works. I got really lucky. I could put down a Sita Skanda with her big Sita Skanda. But the randomly generated action cards. Let's think about this. Usages, usages plus one active character twice per round. So that might actually be something I want to put on the end. Possibly. 
Oh, okay. Sometimes they do something kind of like that in America, too. Next elemental skills deal two damage. So I'd really want to be switching around to do that. Let's think. All of this is actually pretty good. But I don't know what else I have. That's the thing. So, oh, but do I have her talent? If I had her talent, Seed would actually apply Dendro, too. Wait, why can homemade Lehman Solo kill you? It doesn't easily get contaminated somehow, or...? Oh, okay, that's what you mean. Okay, I see. Huh. Well, let's think about this. Do I actually want... Or actually... Maybe... Who do I want to have? I didn't get as many... So I wanted the one who can even equip this is Nahida anyway. Twist per round triggers a reaction. Well, you know what? Maybe we could try that. Veterans message is okay. Maybe I'll. Friday is actually kind of garbage. Okay. Not on you, Dendro. See the sky. They're strong. Oh my goodness. So. Just as a shot. So, why does Lehman Solo? Why is it specifically vulnerable to becoming very, very alcoholic? Is it because of the sugar in the lemon, or does the acidity have something to deal with it? Or maybe you just have to add a lot of sugar to counteract the acidity of the lemon? It's, I'm curious. Very interesting. They're probably trying to prevent me from getting a reaction off oh because you can't monitor as well is that what it is hmm. armor pearl negate one damage school of fish plus one in that back bunch of our thunder one pearl armor negate one damage hmm. okay so is he staying on field or is he just trying my best to actually use up all my dice. Gonna switch or you gonna... Oh, okay. So the reason it's dangerous is because people are crazy. Okay. I think I understand. Oh, okay. Oh, and it heals off now. Interesting. I wonder how I'm gonna do this then. Okay, but I do have that, so I could... Actually, you'll see the Skanda is Dendro damage. If I can make that work, that's gonna be crazy. Okay, so let's actually... Okay, fair. Let's just go for Searing Strike, I suppose. What else would I want to use? Hmm. A bit of healing on one of them could be nice. And what's your next health again? think. Fair. But at the same time, if people are dying drinking lemon and sour, getting drunk from a single shot, I wonder how many how many people would have high tolerance like that. Fair. Switch to Tola. In that case, what we can do is well actually put the seed down. That's the it's using his perverse. Let's heal up real quick. Oh, and we got a bit more. Oh, what we could do actually is... Put this, we could put the seed on everyone this way, but we could also... Do also... Also deal more damage. Would be the best way to use up all of my... Things. Because that pizza's good, but then it'd be something wasted. That's the thing. Mm, don't really need that. Okay, I'll just use this. Get the seed on everyone. Okay, okay. Well, I guess it's... They know what their people like. Oh, that's bad news. You're gonna, you're gonna destroy me. You're gonna try to blow me up, right? Yep, okay. Oh, goodness. So I need to find a way to get... And hit on field at the end, maybe. Let's see. Getting the feet and heat on field at the end, I can spam some reactions, actually. Oh, oh. And you can feel it hit you that quickly? That immediately? 
Oh my goodness. That... It's not that I don't believe you, it's just... It's kind of crazy. Let's just see if I... Scorpion, Guardian Stance, one damage. Oh, only that character. Hmm. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, so we could do the... Oh, but wait. When I say you could play me, I mean in the heated battle mode where we actually get random characters. Okay, we can get that on field. So if we switch around, we can find a way to hopefully get someone on field at the end. Let's see. Uh, what kind of... Oh goodness, and that alcoholic. That's cool though. Go for a... I'm trying my best to get Nahida in. Let's see. Veteran's Visage. Cheered or healed. It's to be different. Oh, okay. Alright. If we're gonna switch. If we're going to switch. Veterans. She's got a Veteran's Visage. The healing should maybe help. But the Gale Blade, though. Who has the ability to actually... If you switch to Toma, no matter what you did, you could actually do this. You could actually make it work. Oh, is on the field. So you would actually have to survive. Like Gilblade. Switch to the next character. Let's think about this. Oh, but if you Gilblade me in. Oh, this might be brutal. Gilblade Nahida in. And then put down my seed. At least for a little bit, it deals some extra dendro damage. Oh baby. They're really in for it now. Go for it. Go for it. I dare you. I dare you. Okay, okay. Interesting. Bad boy to work. Okay. Cool. In that case, we switch you in. Can't do much, but we get some stuff down. Switch that around. Oh, you switched to Toma. Okay. Well, alright. Come on, come on. Let's use this. Four. Okay. Chino and we got that in. Alright. Can't do any switching, but... Mm. And heat is down. That's kind of worrisome, but it'll deal. Dendrotype damage. Wait, will it? What? Hey. That... In the field opposing characters, they're affected by converted to dendro damage? How did that not work? Oh wow. Barely tastes the lemon. Maybe keep this burning going. Let's see. What are you gonna do? Gonna go tap me down with a normal one? Sure, do that. Tap me down with a normal attack. Actually, overplay your hand and go for the cannon. I think you should do that. I think you should be dumb. Okay, no, he went for the normal. Makes sense. Let's go here. We're about evenly matched. About. Okay. Hmm. Oyora is gone. But, actually, if we revive Nahida, the Skada damage will hopefully come back. Does she have that on her? Let's see. Let's try this. Does she have that on her still? Oh, it actually takes it away. That sucks. That was... Oh, that actually... That's gone. Alright. I try sometimes. Where did I get... Oh, that, I don't have the pearl attached right now. Okay. Should I heal someone? Probably. Maybe. Yeah, that was kind of a waste. Oh, interesting. Go for that, why don't you? Okay. That was just an experiment, but we should be fine. Hmm. Actually, no, I don't really feel like healing up anyone other than maybe the seahorse. Possibly. Let's think about this. But for another, yeah, that would just be physical. So we'll just heal you, and that'll be it. Actually, what we do is we switch, we sack Nahida, and we chill. Okay. There we go, and 
I think we can do this. I think we're good to go. We've got a little bit more health. There's only so much they can do to me. Got that burning down. Got some overloads, but also, also, we can... Once we get the burst off, we can use that funny hot pot to make it deal even more damage. Depends on how many electro dice we get to use. Let's see, let's see. This should be workable. This should be eminently workable. Laban, Laban, Laban. Okay. My burst up. Yeah, we'll be good to go. That only takes three, so. Oh, right, you can do that. Never mind. Oh, good God. I hate you so much. Well, we can at least deal with you like this. I don't think you can really do much now that all the elements are gone. Over, normal damage, switch is a normal attack. Well, let's see. That, what can you do? What can you even do? What can you even really do? Hmm. Well, let's just try our best. Can't use that, that's a burst. Hit you, okay. You're just trying to prolong the inevitable. And we quit it around, no matter what we do, we will be able to move in for you. Be five, but the overload will do it. There we go. Sure. I would be willing to try that out. And then we could do the last heated battle match I need. Okay. I am going to finish this off. Should be fine. Yeah first, but what can they do? Not much. Oh, but actually, they're probably gonna burst to try to survive a little longer. Okay. Mm. Oh. Little dice. Oh, that really can't do that much. It's not dealing any damage right now. You heal yourself a little, but. Oh, that actually. What? Oh, because, right, the Seed of Scott is still on there. Two from the overload and one more from the seed. Goodbye. Oh, that must have been humiliating. Okay. I gotta take a quick bathroom break, but I'll be right back afterwards. And then we can do a co-op match. And also, I need to do one more heated battle mode match, and we can actually do that together. So I'll be right back. Thank you for your patience.
Back. Okay. Come on in. Let's do this thing. Join anytime. I'm ready. Come on, come on. Charge it up. Hey. Not sure about that one. Pressure wash Albedo. I don't think. I'm, I'm not sure that fits my character, though. It's a little different than the ideas I had set out at the start. Okay, well, whenever people feel like joining up for a TCG match, I'm down. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, okay. Oh, I'll just wait. Walk around a little bit, perambulate. Come on, come on. Let's save to one, two, three, four, five. Okay, cool. Goodbye. Okay. Okay, should I just go for the final heated battle mode match or so I did want to maybe do that with that team. But did I actually remember to I didn't remember to collect my rewards. Never mind. Let's grab that. Get a bit more for a few more skins. What happened? Is was there an issue with the deck or what do you mean? Oh! Just join my world. That's all you gotta do. And then we just go to this board over here. It's not simple. That, and we can get all the skins this way. Even though I don't have those last three cards. Last four, actually. Skins, thank you, thank you. Cool. This. Get the side of blade. Veterans Visage. Okay. This support. Okay, we can go Darbaville next. Battle time. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. Okay. Lots more stuff. Let's go over to. Ah, okay. Yeah, take your time. Oh. Okay, cool. We could do a normal co op match, but we could also. What deck am I using? Okay, take your time. I'm just going to use the summon deck I normally use. It's not original. I got it from KQM, but it's good. It's preeminently usable. Mm. Okay. Alright. Over here. It's... Okay. Come on, come on. Just gonna keep jumping around, I guess. I wonder how the Albedo elevator will work inside here. It won't. <laughs> Could it work in the middle? Let's see. And, huh. It's kind of under the chandelier then. Let's see. Will it go up? What is it under? It's still kind of under the chandelier, maybe. Move it over a little. And yes, we can. We can take the elevator to the second floor. There we go. Cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One more time. Okay, there we go. It is a very pretty skill, even if it is a little silly at times. Old Beto Vader. Okay, cool. And we get off, and it disappears, and now it disappears again. So okay. Don't mind me, I'm just riding the elevator. Up and down. Alright, I didn't even think about it. Two Albedos. That's crazy. 
Ah. Let's have him sit down. Sit down, sit. Okay. If you have an albedo, we could have all the albedos sit at the same table. No pressure. Sake. Oh, I can't put the flower on the table. Well, it's not really albedoception. Because then there would have to be an albedo contained within an albedo. This is more just two times albedo. Double beto. Alba double. Come on, come on. Oh, you know what? Cinnabar spindle. Show that off at least. If someone else puts one in, sure. Come on, come on. Also, there are... Let me see. There's another place in Prakasha, actually. Right over there. Okay, cool. I'm ready. I'm ready. We're floating. Okay. We'll go out match. Got the right one? Okay, good. My right, teammate. Here we go. Accepted already. Nice. Oh no, I've accepted. I've accepted the duel. Wings to what? Do you know yet? Hmm. I will say. Just warning you that the entire point of this deck is my deck is doing piercing damage via electrocharged, which will bypass the shields you've got. So just keep that in mind. So who do I want to put in? Let's see. These are all right. That's okay. I'm excited. It's going to be a lot of fun. Ooh. Lost elemental die, so that would kind of switch it out. Okay. Hmm. All right, all right then. Try this out. None of those will be all that useful for me. Oh my goodness! I'm sorry. I gotta get starting. Starting roll dice. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this out. Get some electro down. This should be good. Do what you like, do what you like, do what you like. Honestly, I wouldn't even mind if you screen peeked. Frank, it would compensate for that lucky roll. It would only be fair. Could it hit me with a shield or something? Or, let's see. Oh, a sword on Kaza. Before you start, oh, you're just going to try to start with the Stelly? Hmm. Well, either way. Oh, actually, okay, normal. We're done, and Atsuki, and then use an artifact official, then wait, wait, uh, but I can't do all that much, interest, actually, because that's two, that'll be a bit of an issue maybe, uh, wouldn't call that a horrible play, but let's think about this, let's think about this. Yeah, that just switched to Ocean Ed. Got an artifact equipped now, and that does mean Ocean Hued might be able to work, but we'll see. You could switch. Depends on who you want to get in. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe I could have waited for Dunyar's Eye to try to play that Paimon at less cost, but... There's no way to guarantee, no way to know for sure which card you're getting next, so it's just... There are a lot of moving parts of this deck. Quite frankly, you do have to get more than a little lucky. Oh, you, you gotta... You gotta end the round. Okay. Well, it'll automatically end at the end. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, I don't want to rush you, sorry. <laughs> Take your time. Find it funny that your icon is Nuvia and mine is Wanderer when Wanderer was in your party and until recently Nuvia was in mine. Okay. Hmm. Well, either way, once the timer is down. Okay, here we go. So you'll move first. I haven't been hit, so that die is just going to waste. That kind of sucks. Hmm. Healing deals damage, consumed, increase. Do I want. Put Ocean Hued on you? No, I don't. 
Uh, this is the first viewer match I've ever done, actually. It's pretty fun. Mm -hmm. So if you hit me first, well, don't want to give give away the game too much. Okay, there we go. And could we actually? Sure, this would be fine. Put that on you too. Get a bit of healing. Incentivize that healing. So she's got some clam on there now. That's just play that. Actually, maybe I could put maybe I could put two down. I think that might be the best use of. Wait, five, eight, two. I'm trying to think about the most optimal way to play these. No, I think I, I think I know what I'm doing. I think I know what I'm doing. I hope I know what I'm doing. Let's just put this down then. See if I can get a bit of healing. You could go for that crystallize, maybe. Oh no, you did go for double. I honestly didn't even notice the other day. Okay, we're gonna. That's the end of that. Okay, well. Alright. Hmm. So I really could have and probably should. Oh no, you're gonna. Interesting. Just gonna use that for the switch. I will say. The Azda Arcane Legend is actually not all that good. The Global one is usually considered to be the best. All the others are incredibly situational. The Global one you do have to sit on, so it's actually best to shuffle it back into the deck at the end, but still. But that, I should have. I should have put down two. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I would recommend picking it up when possible. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I guess I'll try to heal next time. But as you can see, doing a bit of piercing spread damage by way of electro charge reactions is really, really nice. If it can make it work for you. And it is a little vulnerable to randomness, but still. Ha. Huh. Got a bit more from the pylon. Let's see. Let's see. I want to use some of those for Lyban, maybe. I don't know how I can ramp. Huh. If I heal up there, we'll see. Oh, interesting burst. I'm trying to get a bit more burst damage out of Rodea. I see you. But if you're trying to get more energy to use your burst for damage, if you're trying to do synergy with the pillar and all, I would recommend actually, if you can, using her three, three dice skill twice instead of her five dice skill once, because you get two energy instead of one RG that way for only one more die. And that does sometimes infringe on action economy, but still. Come on, come on. And how many? Maximum of two. But I'm not really a good TCG player, but it's... Especially if you're just refreshing them. But yeah. And did they... No, you have... One seed I'd film. Okay, so let's play that one more time. Put down another mimic, I suppose. Oh, but I could. Maybe I could send off. That's something to think about. Depends on who's got elements on them. Because I don't think you could do it. Yeah, exactly. If you had been on someone else, you could have switched around to try to apply Hydro to Crystallize, but the. It's not gonna be all that important. Hmm. I could use send off, because there's not much else I could really do right now. So I could put down Lyban, maybe. Oh, but either way, he's not gonna get the right amount of dice. Not the right amount or the right kind. Subtract from its uses. Let's actually get rid of that one. So they all disappear next turn. Possibly. Okay, there we go. She's got a seed eye film now. Oh, this? This might be a little cruel. I think Rodea will be gone. Yeah, Rodea is gonna go away. Because I'll get one reaction in. And then, the uh, because the electro was already there, and then Oz and the frog will get a few more down. Some decks are quite good. But it... Don't worry about it. It's a learning experience. It's about getting the right kind of 
reactions going using your summons. Using summons as a way to set up improper reactions. And for what it's worth, the revival food is really not worth using most of the time. Yeah. The thing about it is, is that the Ito card, or the one that gives you energy in, a, in an Omni Dice when one of your characters dies, is quite good. But if you kill a character with summons, then the other guy can't use it. Because it has to be played on their turn. Oh, that was good damage. I want to switch. It's actually... Hmm. Oh, but I don't have any healing. That's gonna hurt. That said, probably I should just put down... That. Put Oz back down. See what I do now. Yeah, just... Yep, exactly. Do that. Got that, but... Play that for an extra die. That that will okay, so I don't actually need to use Depths Temptation. Say goodbye to your Shongli. There we go. My apologies. Yeah. I did exactly what you were trying to do. Sorry if that hurt a little. Should just play a few more. Put down another mimic or so. That would work. By the way, you will get a crystallized shield out of this. Hey, hey, you gotta, you gotta start him young. There's no sense going easy on that if all they're trying to do is actually get good at the game. I'm just gonna put down another ocean and mimic. And okay, next round. Cool. So much we deal here. Maybe you did get that crystallized shield. Zero damage. Two damage. Two more damage. Okay. If you really wanted to be mean, I would just end my round right here. That would be the premier level of disrespect. Oh, that's what was going on. Okay. So it's more or less a matter of me getting good luck and you getting bad luck. Fair. Let's see. Let's actually finish this off pretty elegantly then. Possibly. So if I really wanted to, I could be really mean. Like I said, I could just not make any moves and let my summons kill you. But that would be way too mean, honestly. I don't feel bad about that. Okay. So in that case, I think we can get the Vaporize. The best way to finish things off would be... Noel switch into Pyro Agent, and then... Oh, you had... Oh, right, you did a Clip of Sword. Like that, we go with that for the quick switch. Switch, and... If I wanted to, I could go for the normal, but it's more fun if you do the reaction. Thank you. Good day. You want to do the Heat of Battle mode now? Because you can do it with someone in co-op, and I do need to do one more match. You did well. You had a fun deck idea, and if I hadn't gotten lucky with dice, you probably would have beaten me. Cool. Yeah, exactly. You didn't get to see me get humiliated. Fun is teleporting. Okay. Enjoy your teleportation. Okay, let's do this. Let's do it. I can't see me anymore. Hmm. So who would combine well? That's the question. Wait, wait. Let me see. Oh, oh, you're doing lantern right just now. That's cool. I put in Ito. Take Ito. Cool. And after that, who? Whom? Dang. It's... You like him that much? Or... Are you scandalized? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm gonna take this nice and slow. Oh, fair. Oh, oh! So you wouldn't have done it otherwise. Okay, fair. Glad you're back and enjoying it, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Take your time, take your time. Yeah, I got the Shanho one. Because I could only get one of the crystals I had. It's actually, this could be good. Burning comp. Okay. <laughs> Let's see about this. Gotta make sure we got the healing up. Who can I send in? Who should I send in first? Some Oyori. And is about to begin. Okay. Customer Sprite. Okay. Hmm. Alright. How am I gonna do this? I don't even know what's in my deck. Come on, come on. Load in, load in. Okay. Oh, or maybe trying to freeze. That could be cool. Uh, hmm, two less, plus one damage. Uh, that might be worth keeping. Actually, go with that Chef Mao. Club Legend. Uh, uh, that's not as important. Let's check this out. Who do I want to send it first, though? Chuma and then maybe. Send and buys you first. Two more for skins. Brutal. Okay, so that's actually pretty decent for now. I'm sure that my intentions are more than obvious. Okay. Put that down. Weapon or artifact card, one less less die. No more attack. Uh, food card. Huh. Well, we'll go for that. First. Okay. But who do I want to switch in? What, how, and why? Why don't you go for your rock, paper, scissors combo? Why don't you do that? That's good damage. Hmm. That couldn't backfire at all. What are you gonna, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? So I'm sure you can tell what I'm trying to get going here. I don't think I need to say it. I've given you enough hints. Okay. Mm -hmm. Take your time, take your time. Just trying to figure this out. Normal attack. Okay. Is another normal attack? Where are you Huh. What do I want to put in? What card can I afford to actually just lose? Huh, Yuan. Alright. Hmm. One random basic elemental die when you play a food card. Okay. That in on you. Cool, one random basic. Oh, we actually got exactly what I needed. That's kind of nasty. Okay, one two power no. damage, one blazing barrier. If you're smart, you'd switch. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is gonna hurt a little. I could put this on Ito, maybe. He would be the only one really using normals. I don't know, though. But I don't know. If I switched out, Shadow oh, Little. Do need to get him in one way or the other. Okay, let's see. Super Sprite, Denver Damage. There we go. We have healing, but now we've got Blazing Flame. Cool. Also, we have the oh yeah, the Boising Barrier up. Okay, so who do we want in right now? Who should I go? Who should I send in next? Well, I know who I need to send in next. Okay. Mm -hmm. I want to use... Tabby to have your location support, but I don't need any location support. I'm not using any of that. Hmm. It's per round, food event card, turn that into a die. Hmm. I'll think about this. It's all about getting Ito. No problem. Thanks for popping in. Enjoy the rest of Lantern Ride, I suppose. <laughs> okay, so. Put down Ushi. Sign a Ragon. Okay. Who else can I send in? Pyro's good one way or another. It is guaranteed kind of a shield, but. Huh. 
Still and steady does win the race. I will say that in modes like these with random teams, when you have the chance to be at defensive, I would recommend it. Okay. Here we go. Let's put in... Kujirai? No. Actually, yes. Kujirai. Oh. Uh, that was me to me. Okay. I don't really need two links, so we can just go for a standard. Okay. Who should I put this on? Who should I put this on? Huh. Yeah, shields, healing, sustain in general. Most good decks have some focus on that. Because... Shields especially, I would say that the best artifacts in the TCG period are probably... Let's see. It's three times per round, eh, but no one's really using normals. Best artifacts in TCG are probably the Tenacity of the Mill with two-star and three-star hats. Because they allow you to just get free shield points and also even free dice sometimes. And it's really, really hard to beat that in terms of usefulness. Okay, well. Nothing to do but wear them down. Okay. Let's keep on looking. Could maybe try to send an Ushi again. I'll think about it. Raising barrier and Ushi. Yeah, but if you have a totally full support zone, you can play Kid Kuzurai with utter impunity. You don't have to worry about possibly getting the enemy to... <sighs> so Muji Muji Dharma... Oh, the Muji Muji Dharma doesn't do elemental absorption either. I just don't have Sire right now. Let's actually go for a quick heal. Let's see. Should I? No. Do I really need Holistic Revivication right now? Do I really need it right now? Hmm. Let's think. I could actually put this on Hito. Oh, that's dirty. Play that, get the burst down, put down Toma. Let's think about this. No, no, these. These ones. Okay. Had to be selective. With some clarity and one seamless shield. Cool. Oh, but that didn't actually. But wait, wait. Seamless shield, put some clarity. It's just two. Injure damage and heal for one HP. Hmm. Could I go for a blazing barrier? Possibly. Oh, but if you swirl that on me, that could be dangerous. Hmm. I assume you're trying to keep that hypostasis in to try to have it clean up with its five dice attack? Maybe. Okay. Hmm. Alright, yep, there we go. They've all got. Reactions on the note. Oh, maybe you're trying to go for some electro charge. That could be cool. Interesting. Show me again, why don't you? Why don't you do that? Oh, well, that works too. Let's get the barrier up. Poison barrier is. Its use is just two, actually. So I don't need to really wait all that much. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. The big thing is just, you always want to be using up as many dice in a round as possible. It's easy to, it's easy to lose some, but turn advantage is about, well, gradually getting an advantage is about squeezing use out of every die you have, ideally. And it's not that easy, it takes a lot of strategic thought, but it's ultimately what makes the difference. Oh, now you have it. Okay. Nice. It's just Leoroi. Oh, and I can get another use off that. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, then. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. Hmm. I don't want to put down what can I really make use of. Because if I'm that smart, this could get turned around pretty quickly, actually. 
I need to be intelligent and diligent. Oh, you're trying to go for. Hmm. It's hard to really make the most use of it. make the most use out of it unless you really have. Oh, let's see, actually use that and through the. Okay, well, will this stop your assault or will you keep going? So, well, okay. Here we go, and gonna keep going. You actually are going to keep going. Interesting. In that case, let's see. Could actually get a bit of crystallize on that, I think. Oh, uh, yeah. Getting stuck on that is an issue. Sorry about this one. Okay, support card, weapon card, but nobody's really getting a weapon. Hmm. Okay. Alright. I guess I could maybe try to heal with Baiju at the end. We'll see. Gotta think this one through. Okay. Oh, nice. That was good. Smart, smart. Do one of those. Don't need to change the dice type at all. Just need to switch. Okay. Over there. Okay, cool. Bit of a crystallize. Should be fine. Mm -hmm. Depends on who can snipe who. Because uh, this might be a bit of a, a bit of a struggle. We'll see. Oh yeah. Ito could definitely get sniped. Because Baiju does not actually have for lack of a better term, true healing, I'd say. Let's see. You know what? Normal by Baiju normal is burning DPS. We'll go for that. Hmm. Let's see. Normal attacks, normal attacks. Yeah. It's getting dangerous. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see. Just one. That would get some fire down on the field. There we go. Let's check this out. See how this can work. Who can or should I sack? Oh, but she'll be reliant on using normals is kind of an issue. Eh. Hmm. Let's see. Nice. Go for the dice. But, but, look at that. Oh, but you had a shield. Okay. Goodbye, though. My apologies. Hmm. But, but. The round, I guess I could play that for a few more cards. Sure. Okay. My cruiser right back. Fire on you. Should be alright. Okay. Frankly, I wasn't able to get an Ito nearly as much as I wanted. So his utility was mostly on the defensive front. Yeah, turtling did did me some good. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Get this is a few more normals maybe. Try to get a bit more burning in. How do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? Either way, it's a three-on-one fight at this point, so... It'd be really funny if I... Well, you did manage to kill Ito. That's nice. It's a good swirl. Swirl and the Electrocharge procced. Okay, but... I think I'm up decently. Pull and kick, just one. That's plus some clarity. Hit me again. Okay, the heal should help. Nothing else I can keep going with the burning. Swirl should be much more. We'll see. Hmm. And dash. Okay. Hmm. And a little bit more is done, but here we are. Okay. Should be able to knock this down at the end. A bit more burning in and... Okay. Huh. Hmm. This is really coming down to the wire. Played a mean game. Okay. 
more, but that will heal you. Oh, by two. Okay. Hmm. So how can I do this? This is going to be complicated. Definitely can't afford a switch. Okay, this is good. I'm just going to tap with Baiju and... Oh, but we did get Asuma's shield. That makes some difference. Maybe there, Gossamer Sprite. If you kill me, then I just tap you down a bit more. Okay. We should be alright. Should be alright. We'll see. Ninja Blade. Okay. And, oh, I'm so sorry. We're gonna die to the Baiju normal. Good game. That was really close. There we go. Yeah, I... I can pretty safely say that that was the difference of luck and not skill. Good job. Good job, really. So the only thing that really comes to mind at this point is I've got a bit more to explore in Chenyu Vale. I'm gonna try to clear out the rest of Southern Mountain and maybe get the rest of... Oh, hi. That's what I can buy from the shop, possibly. I can get... Support. I can get Storm Terror's Lair just a barely. Okay. In that case. In that case. I think I'll go over to Chenyo. Oh my goodness, Wanderer joined the TCG staff. I knew he was looking for things to do, but that was a surprise to me. Either way, that's done. Cool. Anything else? You need any domain help or anything? Or you have any resin elf that you want to use? You don't anything come to mind? I'm here and I'm willing to help. Wait, what? It's coming through and I saw it's in the skybox. Okay, so I'm going to raise just a skybox outside. Interesting. And it makes sense, because probably they render the entirety of the world outside of an instance, but it's fun to get that kind of confirmation. Okay, cool. This one has a cool. How's it Hey! I'm saying the Japanese voice lines. I don't even know if you're using the Japanese. But take your time, do as you like. Can I put it down on top of. I can put it down on top of the railing. Obviously, it can't go all the way up, but I can put it on the railing. Interesting. Okay. Okay. But if nothing else, I'm probably just gonna go export Chenyu and see if I can get all the plumes and see if that makes the other guys show up. Because there is a local legend in Laijin, if I recall correctly. But I haven't been able to find it, even though I'm in 100% of the area or so it says. So I might explore and then just try to get the rest of the spirit carp. Okay. If you want to run no blessed domain real quick. I would be okay with that. Mm. Mm. But what I will say is... <sighs> okay. In that case, over to Liwei it is. So then over here. Oh, but I should join you. I should join you instead of the other way around. So that way you can control the pace. Okay. So I will, if you don't mind, disband it very quickly. Okay, okay. Thank you for popping in. Temporarily unable to... Okay. What? 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 Come on, come on. Please. Okay. Alright, okay. It really said, nope, they have to stay. You're stuck. Stuck with them. Goodness. In that case, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm just going to switch the team back eternally. I log off and log back in, and you're still there. I don't think that would actually happen. Shin He on you, you and Gaming. There's my team. Back to Chenyu. Gonna check out. It's a bit left over there, but the main thing I was still trying to explore was 
how do I get in there? That's the real question. So there was a little bit over this way. This bit over on the wall, as well as this little part with this base camp, I think. Okay, well, either way, I'm going back to the wall, and there was a storeroom that I needed to go inside, too, so we're gonna see. Bring Beast of Legend. Exercise, bring luck. Okay, cool. If we want to do this, what we do is... Let's try this out. Hello, overall. Oh, come on, just... Oh, that already worked. Oh, okay, you. Normals, but actually, right, we could just swing to that, and they should do it. And there we go. Using Shadow Head of Bok Gandhi is usually not all that useful. Because usually, if you're in Abyss or something, you're using Gani for her bursts. But if I'm just in here using Gani for charge attacks, well, it actually works quite well. 24k on, on the charge attack? Is that what you're commenting on? Are you saying that's good or bad? Okay. Well, what I'd say in response to that is... Oh, but I hit it, so it disappeared. Well, well. Gani was just a crit damage finished wizard's rare attack. Also, she was being buffed both by Viridescent Venerer from Xian Yun and from Shen His Icy Quills. So even though this was overruled, there was actually a pretty high amount of buff stacking going on there. What I'm trying to say is don't get discouraged. But there is that one over there. Okay, take your time. Have a safe drive. A couple of eggs over here. Okay, cool. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for popping in. If this is goodbye, then sign ragged. I'm just gonna keep exploring the area around Shijun. Come on, come on. That one over there. Have I already been inside? I know I've been inside here already. There's other walls over there I'm not too sure about. Mm -hmm. Back, get this little bit, a little bit of iron, okay. Sooner fly route is pretty good actually, so I will continue doing that. I already got that ceiling, I already got the ceilings over here some time ago. What is investigate? And tower gates, okay. And scorch notes. Reading this congratulation for traps up by Moloch many centuries past like I have. I don't believe a single word of the inscription upon the mechanism. Explosion self-destruction intimately acquainted with life and death. Okay. Well, I already got blown up, but... Actually, it didn't even kill me when I did get blown up, so... Not a real problem. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Beasts over there, but I actually already got rid of them. It's not really a big deal then. This over here is... Tablet orders from above money as record date for the return. Supplies and equipment. It's in the event of an emergency. Oh. She's on map. Above date for the return. This image. Okay. So the key would be over there. And that was the jade thing that I already got and interacted with, so... The piece from Lysian and the piece from a little bit west of... a little bit east of Lysian. So once I find that key, we'll be good to go. Right. And nothing up here. Yeah, seems like it. Mountains over there. Hong Kong grounds, and... Lysian's actually over that way. Hmm. I got most of this. Almost all of this, really. Okay, well, I'll come back once I've gotten the key. Let's just look inside. We can't even get inside there, even though there is a little bit of a crack. I need to down here, I think. Yeah, I have. Come on, come on. Oh, but... No, no, that's... I keep getting baited by... The ones that are related to Lantern Knight. I will need to go back to those locations to make sure they haven't replaced anything, but don't predict it will be all that troublesome one way or the other. Okay. Hmm. 
So, should be around here maybe. Either this camp or this. Last set of ruins. That's what I'm predicting. That said, prediction would only take you so far. Hi. And multiple enemies should. Let's see. Come on, come on. Who can I get? Can I. Oh, well. Got two goats down. It is darkly humorous. The best way to slay those goats is by using Ganyo. Arguably, the goat herself. In multiple ways. Multiple ways. Let's just go over there. We got that challenge. That is. There's nothing that I see over there. That one was a challenge before, a challenge that I did. Okay. Hmm. And there might be another tablet around here that I can check and glean some info from. Yeah, right here. Tablet, names and deeds, and all that engraved on the front. Records of the battles on the back, deeds of aid, and numbers of reckoning. This wave, these came. Is there armor around? Royal defense is shattered, calamity wound, green beast, and little adeptus. After, oh, that would have been Nguyen, probably. Nowhere to be seen. Disaster about them. Away the ravagers. Soldier master of the mountain. A swanee. No such form. Adept is transformed. Is in remembrance. Mountain troops. Adept will favor. Shion favor. So maybe that was Nguyen in human form. Who knows? So there's another one for me to grab. And oh, there's another one of those ruin puzzles. <laughs> Clearly, it's actually inside a bit of the mountain if I can't get one to this. Hi. Oh no, it's actually just up there. And oh no, those are. Oh, the local legends were just over there. Okay. Got a little area blocked out for them. That's cute. Well, deal with that. You know what? You know what? Just get it now. So that does mean that I don't actually need to get every plume right now. I mean, every carp right now. Let's put in... Furina, Furina. Farzan. These guys. Okay. This is my, arguably, my best plunge-oriented team. And that would be a good way to make sure they don't move around too much. And you are... Hi. You are... Oh, and now you're getting in the same place. Wait for you to... Hi! Chujang Mountains, Yuji, and Tianyu. Oh, okay. Let's get that and... Come on. I'm gonna make sure we can take them out at the same time. Roughly. Oh, and they've actually permanently infused. Oh, interesting. And they fight relatively similarly to... Oh my goodness. Taking a lot of hits from this. Not like this. Come on, come on, and... Heal me, heal me, heal me. And, oh goodness, this is bad, this is bad. Come on, come on. Oh, spikes. This is very, very new. What, what, what? Oh, good. Okay. Well. I'm gonna need to steal myself. Thought I might be able to get by without a shield, but it doesn't look like that. Who uses fodder for. Energy. This is more than a little disturbing. Okay. Tion Yu and Yi Ji. Heaven something, something else. Alright. Come on, come on. Using Fab should be a good way to do some of it. Okay, let's just go here. Let me back pretty easily. Let's go. And let's actually use that to cut a bit of a bit of a bit more as well. Come on, come on. Okay. Right again. Actually, she's got a good plan. Should take her a lot of the way. Cool. Nice. Got that back. Do I want to try that again? Possibly. So it's just over there. Hmm. Okay. As long as I can try to stay out of the way of some of their attacks. I will say, though, this is not a team particularly oriented for dodging. 
can't stagger the enemies. They hurt me a lot. It said, can I freeze it? Can I freeze him? We'll have to see. It's a permanent cryo infusion at the very same time. Am I, gonna get a, am I going to get a chest out of this? That's the real question. Either way, they don't really do anything until they get too close, so we can wait for them to converge, hopefully. We'll see. Okay. Join in the middle. Close. I wouldn't say it's kind of a yin yang, but yin yang, but they're going around again, looking up in the middle. And there we go, and. Okay, so it's actually not looking all that well in terms of. Oh goodness, that's just. So we dash some of that. Come on, come on. But if you. Okay, jump, dash, jump, and. Okay, but yeah, you're actually fighting barely very similarly to the. Half is more bishop. Okay, well, wait, oh, did I catch it? Not one of you over, maybe? Let's see. Oh, goodness, it's not. Oh, but I'm running out of stamina. That's not good. And then, come on, and dodge. That, oh, goodness. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. And then just, right. Okay, oh, but you stay kind of in the middle there. It wasn't, it wasn't really an issue. Come on, come on, that's just. Oh, the energy there might be a problem. Problem, problem. Okay, we just need to con things so we have to die. Okay. Which one is... How much health are we going to come back with? I like, feel like one of the others. This is... Because now we're going to summon that back. Come on, come on. Come on, it's on this. Please, and just... Come on, come on. Come on, we pick it as you, and that's just... Oh, goodness. Okay, that timer is actually quite generous though. Heal, heal. Okay, there we go. And one, one, punch, punch, punch. Oh, you got that back. But actually, it's not about the health. Okay, we'll just punch you down the rest of the way. And let's just. Where's the witchy young man's? Goodbye. Good amount of materials, too. That was a fun fight. Frankly, it would be easier if I had to deal with heavier defenses, but that was fun. I liked using gel on that. Powers of the Chijun Mines. Actually, if I had used... If I had used Game, I wonder if I would have damaged them more evenly, but it depends on what Furina would have hit. Because I wouldn't have been able to... Wait, I wonder if I would have been able to get a Vaporize and a Melt on the same hit, which would have been crazy damage-wise. If... I don't know, though. Because normally those auras don't coexist. You just, on enemies with a permanent freeze immunity, just the both disappears, but there was Hydro and Krill coexisting on that enemy. But it'd be something like three times damage from a vaporize and melt on a single attack. But then the other one, I wouldn't be vaporizing anything, but everything through me needed to be vaporized. Frankly, I think Sun was probably Swirls that was getting doing more damage to. One than the other, but at the very same time, the vaporizers were probably more important. Given that the fire pyro one still went down first. Cool. That was fun. Let's just put back in the team I was using before. Okay. Frankly, I didn't even really see how they were attacking. I was kind of in a frenzy myself. Okay. Let's go back down here. Oh, we got some of this over there, but oh, we went over kind of the other side and missed some stuff, so. Two exploding barrels within 30 seconds. Let's not miss. Hi. Other one's over there now. Come on. Come on. Oh, that was actually a cryo barrel. Cryo arrow, I mean. Do not want to end up using a frost wake. Good job, God, dude. That, oh, that whiffs that up to the sky. Oh, interesting. And now the hill trolls are on my tail. Okay, do your thing. Come on, come on. And just go for another headshot. My chance. Okay. How have you dropped anything? Oh. Let's go those were connected. That was an interesting choice. Go up to the sky and get 
something up here? Oh, there was another carp here too. Nice. Okay, just a bit more stuff. Oh, but right, that was the entire reward. Didn't even really think about that. Okay, well, could do. What I think we'll do is use this and just scroll the wall. Get another one too. Oh, thank you. Cool. Get that. And now this should be good. A little bit more. Come on, scroll. Oh my goodness. That was nasty. Okay. And over like that. What do we get? We got Valley oh, Residence Tender Countryside. Okay. 13 more. Spirit Carver left. But, but. Did I already go down to this side? Because I'm pretty sure. Wait. I think I did. I will check. But all this over here, yeah, I went to that can. There's still those dead hillatrules over there. Or indisposed hillatrules. <laughs> Stunned. Oh, and... Okay, so I missed what the sandwich was dropped. I think I got that, I guess. Free stuff. Not free, but... A greatly, great, not free, but at a greatly reduced price. Oh, come on. And, oh goodness. Let's just, okay. Or we can just climb up. That works too. Come on, come on. Okay. Hmm. All right, all right. So there's a bit more over here, so I wonder if this would recount. Tablet, evil spirits, and chinny veil of them, love and intent. Just of all, ancestors regard ward up demonic peril. It's for the names, might sound as strong as the immovable Millwith. Well, it's, it's sort of an Osmondaeus thing, because their names are all gone. I suppose maybe that's the intended dramatic irony. Hi. Let me get that. One more, and we went for the standard, not the crossway. No cluster. But we. I wouldn't say a snipe. We did manage to shoot it. But I am somewhat proud of myself. Okay. Much more. There was. Wait. Marked this, that little bit over there. Okay, it was marking that part. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. And did that? We did. Stopping your tracks for a short little bit. Hi. Look at that. That was easy. Okay. Come on, come on. Oh, but no, that actually. That did was formidable formation. Fallen Vanguard shall surely say some. The Vanguard. So where would that be? Where is that actual position? Let's see. And the wall, but the. What is so it's here? So, boy, bridges on collapse, but a strike cannot resist the enemy onslaught. Shrek the defenses. Her Majesty. <laughs> okay, let's see. That'll move over to there. The other wall. Maybe from that side. So it's about the position. Let me see. Would this fit here? Would it fit here? Defensive line, crumble in despair. Stream defeat shall inflict. Matters martial is matchless. Okay, cool. Alright. Oh, this out and, oh goodness. Don't want that. Oh, we can just do all that and strike you down. Oh, no BB, but that's fine. And plunge to every fire and death is only to assist you in death. What are you doing? Oh, over there. They all die. Ah, that was cool. Called me the Adeptus. Funny. We were there for the insta kill. Cool. Got a bit more from there. What are you gonna do now? Hi. Is it made? Oh, that. Raffle Simulacrum. Oh, I guess the wrath was the damage it dealt to those couple of enemies. 
I mean, this, is there something under? No, there's nothing under I can get to. That grating was not exactly for show, but not really something I can deal with normally. It's just there, maybe. Cool. And up here, another jumping simulacrum, but none of those are really all that well. Whatever's up in the sky, it's not something I can see right now. Let's just see what's in here. Did I get it? Did I miss it? Let's see. Here we got... I think, yeah, there was one that I climbed up. This was the one. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, goodness. Goodness me. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Hmm. Oh, how'd you launch then she? Aiden Moore 564. I'm slightly wrapping things up. I'm doing a bit more exploration in Chennyvale Southern Mountain. But I'll be on for about 45 more minutes. Thank you for the follow. Big Genshin fan? <laughs> That's not too private a question. Down here, I beat a local legend very slightly before. This is a pretty tough fight. And we're right around here, actually. So how do I go about this? Maybe I go up here, possibly? And there's this little area over this way. A lot of the shore is kind of still technically in Upper Vale rather than Southern Mountain. Well, I missed my strike and got hit instead. Tragic. So up here should be... This is another challenge, I think. Let's see. It's already up there. Yeah, but this was location of the local legend. Oh, so those jumping simulacra are almost certainly going to be the challenge I'm getting over here. Wait, no. Interesting. I'm hoping that this leads me to that gateway I tried to get into before. I'm not holding out too much hope. Okay, shoot that out over there. And where to next? Wait. Okay, the other particles are over that way. So maybe if I shoot myself over there, that might be a little faster. Who really knows at this point? Let's just is that to bounce up a little. Okay. You and you and you. Got a bit more. Was that proximity or just getting the other previous particles? Let's see. And a bit more. Okay, so it's just back to the start. Nothing too complicated. Cool. It already says we've got 100, but clearly we don't actually have 100. Alright. That case, that case. Move on up, see what else I can get over here. So this took me up that way, but there's not much else this way. There was that little area that I went to previously and got a little chest room, but yeah, we're, we're pretty good as far as things go here. Hmm. Well, we could get another wild of grass. Sega being Furho. Again, now that I need any more, I've leveled up literally every character who uses wild grass fully already. All these beasts, don't particularly feel like fighting them again right now. Hmm. So yeah, go down around here, go to that Hillitrol camp. Go down to the village ruins, get the key for the watch. Tower to unlock the storeroom, and then it's a little bit over here. I'll probably actually look up how to get inside that gate. Mm -hmm. It's a nice view over here. Quite pretty. It's a bit more dragon spine and some other things too. Even with the fog and the light, you can make out geography of the surrounding areas, and you can see some placeholder mountains up north where more Mondstadt will hopefully eventually be, maybe. Dormant Port when? Maybe never. Okay, let's do a bit of a dynamic entry, and oh, the Hillertrolls <laughs> captured a treasure hoarder. That's insane. Oh, let's actually go for that. Treatment. Oh, hold on. And what are you going to... Oh, well, never mind. Hi. Over there, snipe. Hi, kill you. 
And the rest is going to be the treasure hoarder in there. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. It's not like you were going to be all that cooperative, even if I did for you. It's a matter of tactics, or realism, maybe, just maybe, a bit of cruelty. An arrowhead, seeds amount of limit. I know I can climb on top of it. Can I climb this edge? Let's see. I might not be able to. Normally I can... Is this one weird? No, I guess it is, because I expected you to use the grapple points. They didn't make the edge climb as it was usually as it... Oh, that makes the other guy show up. Nice. Okay, cool. Let's go over here. Let me... One child have gone and given less. Hi. Just like that. We can hit, hit, get rid of your shield. Wait, how did that... Oh, did that get an overload on me or something? That is weird. Oh, oh alright. A bit more healing than all that. So much damage we can do. Well, whatever. Oh, come on. Not that. Maybe we can... Oh, more spawn in. It's kind of a multi-day fight at that point. And we can... Oh, goodness. Who are they trying to... Oh, they were trying to hit the flower. That's done. Now you are... Is there another chest, or... Okay, and there was one in there. That I either didn't see before, or that just spawned in. And we got in that other chest, and that other enemy encounter spawn. And here we are. Okay, but... There were a couple of enemy drops over there that I didn't see. Were they... Oh, they were from the chest and they fell out. Interesting. Why didn't I see that? Oh, whatever. Okay, so we just got a little bit over here. Shouldn't be that much more than can. It's just... Survey the area. Nothing really... comes to mind visually. Okay. A bit more... A couple of so I can eliminate with... Out of Shen Hoprat and a new charge attacks. It's nice that you don't need to actually hit an enemy to get damage bonus up. Come on, come on. Can you actually get up high? Oh, you can't pass that wall, but we can hit you with the AoE on our charge shot. Good stuff. How much more? How much more? Get a little bit over here, a little bit over this way. This is where I stopped previously. So I should get the key from there. Maybe. That looks like the kind of place they'd store a key. I think. Let's think about this. Get both of these and like this. Go through and... Oh, it really was that easy. Chizhong map and the warehouse seems to be ancient city key. Chizhong somewhere along the Chizhong wall. Map, warehouse, map, and I'll go behind. Okay, so we have that. It's another version of the same map we saw before. Cool. And we can just... I do really like that they have... It's kind of crazy that it took them that long. I didn't even really think about it, but... They finally added a piece of world geography in Liyue. It's sort of a fantasy analog of the Great Wall of China. It's pretty cool. I know that there was... Some, I think it was in collaboration between Chinese and Western Studios to a movie called The Great Wall. Some fantasy movie about defending the Great Wall of China from monsters or something. Not entirely sure. Okay. One way or another, it would have been years ago. It's kind of this. Through there, and this one should be over here, I think. Let's see. Can I activate that one from there? Should be able to. And, yep, two somewhat connected teapots that actually have a different chest. Interesting. Well, got a few goats over here. Hi. And just like this. Come on, come on. Hit, hit. Okay, we got the meat. We got the meat. Thank you, goat meat. Indistinguishable from all other kinds of meat. Radio down there, but... Things that really aren't necessary right now are getting rid of that treasure hoarder can, go back to the storehouse, and then clearing out whatever remains in here. Then I suppose I'll actually 
get the rest done next patch, which is good, because it means I'll have something to actually do next patch, even though they won't have added a new area yet. It's all about delegation and distribution. Water over there. It's kind of oceanic, but that's just the lake north of Mount Aujan. Okay, interesting. Over this way. And you already got spooked? Oh, you're insane. That's wacky. Okay. Anything over here? It does not seem like it. Punch back down and a couple of lucky treasure hoarders. Hello. So we can... That done. Oh, goodness. Now I got totally blindsided by the terrain. Come on. Here's another. Hi. For that, and is this going to be it? Wait. Oh, there was another one. Is that going to be it? Let's see. Come on, headshot. Okay, that was it. I was wondering if there was another wave that was going to show up afterwards. Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. Here's a wave. Do we need to remember to take the boat tour eventually when I go up to Northern Vale? Boat tour, boat tour. Boat. Actually, I'm relatively close to a teleport waypoint. Something I could do is actually go and fight Ice with Sweet one more time. I did point on doing that before. We'll see. Look this way. Sure. So I do need a few more of these Usia pieces for a character who is who will currently not be named. Case, we will switch out to a slightly different team than we were using before. It's going to be a plunge team with Sean, Yun, and Farina, but it won't be Zhao because, well, Zhao deals animo damage only, and this team really deals animo damage only, and that would be really, oh, really bad. It's nice and sweet because they resist animo damage and cloud damage. I think, I'm pretty sure they resist more attacks in all their forms, but. It is possible that they resist Animo only in Usia and Pro only in Luma. I'd have to check the wiki, and frankly, it doesn't make that much difference because none of the damage we're dealing right now is Numa or Usia. I mean, Animo or Cryo. Okay. For this, Dirge of Capellia. Okay. Get as many drops as we can. Hi! Karina, Karina, Karina. Orange, orange, orange. Okay, and a bit more. That and. Let's just see. Orange over there. Go for the jump. It's actually better to go for the burst. Four of it seems. It's definitely not that deep. Got a bit more, and how much did we get? We got, got three more. Nice. Tax circle, I don't really need that. But we have gotten as many levels as we can in the battle pass this week. Good stuff. There we go, there we go, there we go. Ah, interesting. So I guess I could go back to the storehouse right now. It should be. It's right over there. Okay. What on that way and. Frankly, the map of Qijang is kind of impressionistic. It doesn't entirely, re entirely reflect the terrain of the area. But that's very much splitting hairs. Come on, come on, come on, and let's go. Go down this way, and yep, storehouse is over here. <clears throat> Collect our treasure and be done with it. Well, be done, with the, be done with that. It's going to tell us about finding minutes a record here for the return, supplies, and equipment for emergencies. But I guess maybe I actually shouldn't be taking that. It'd be really funny if they notated and said, You're a jerk. You took our supplies and now everyone's going to die. It's going to be an achievement. Probably open up the precious chest. We only got a couple of Prima gems. And... Oh, that makes sense. It was all weapons because these are. This is weapon storage. Uh, there's more here. 
Construction of the Endless Wall. So it really is just a wall of China. That's cool. In that case, find the items left behind by the mill with. So we have to clear up a little bit of space for artifacts in our inventory, so... Let's level up now these artifacts just a little bit more. Frankly, even with Serpent Spine, she's kind of unbalanced in favor of crit damage over crit rate, but it is what it is. And that's all we got right now, so we'll need to empty up. I'll need to empty out a bit more space on my own time eventually. Okay. In that case, how much more time until Icewind Sweet actually comes back? One minute. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how much is left in this area? Got the camp done. We got most of that done. Maybe a little bit more over here. But yeah, this upper ridge, this northern ridge, is what's really, really, really getting my goat right now. Let me think about this a bit more. Okay. Curious, curious, curious. Go over here and thought for a second that a few more treasure hoarders might have respawned, but I was literally just mistaking the bundle over there for treasure hoarders, which maybe says I'm going a little crazy, but who doesn't these days? Hmm. Avoid gunning, and I'm pretty sure I already did this lantern puzzle. Let's check. Yep, I can't pick it up or move it, so I've already done it. This is a bit more on the very north part of Tea Tree Slope, but that's actually part of Northern Vale, so I'm ignoring it might be a bit too cruel of a term. But I'm, I'm leaving it for later. Saving it for a more opportune moment. Up on down, grab that. Fly back over. These carp really are fun to make use of. Escape that. Investigate myself and clear myself of wrongdoing. Like on the CIA. Okay. Yeah. Grab clear water jades that only get used by Cloudy Jammer, who's already at 90. And pray fervently for someone else to use them eventually. Okay. So it's just this little ridge up here. A little bit over this way. That's going to be about it for stuff that's actually truly in Southern Mountain. But past even that, raises the question of how I get into the weird adeptal wall over there. Because my best guess would be there's some kind of time trail challenge maybe on the other side of the river and it sends me inside the wall in the end. Because golden carps golden carp stuff can send you inside one of those even if you can't this would pass through them normally. Oh, but the fog explosion killed it. That's silly. Okay, this is still Upper Vale. Hmm. Let's just go here. Check out this spot. I think I checked up here for chests before and found one. But I did that some time ago. Okay. Cool. Interesting. Up on this ridge, and oh, there are a couple of treasure hoarders just chilling around this way. Well, sorry, but we are going to end your miserable lives. Okay. Cool. Come on, come on. Oh, well, I still got hit. Alright. Come on, come on. And you are. Oh, I couldn't get the headshot. That's sad. But, just over there, and. Okay. One, two, three. One, okay. That, that, that. Screw sheep, that, that. Screw sheep, this new. Beautiful treasure. I am happy. Still 100. What are my primos at right now? Next character I'd be rolling for is Chiori. That's a little over. 80, 96, 86, 87. 105, 115. That's already a good amount of a way to. Yeah, by the end of. This patch should have enough to really guarantee her. Which, uh, it remains to be seen how good a Geo character will be. But, 
as a fervent and inveterate collector. I think we're passing the chance to get a new character, if nothing else, because Abyss is going to be suited to that new character for some time. Mm, let's see. I've already been through here, but we can deal with the Geo Bishop this way. A fun like that. Hi. Okay. Let's just hit you. Hi. Got like this. Oh, but we already actually got the. Come on, come on, come on. Or, before you transform, we can just shoot you. And you can glow blue while you die. Alright. I had used Gandhi's burst that might have gone faster. So, non zero chance it actually would have gone slower for the reason that it would have done a lot of startup and maybe actually used up all Shenha's icy quill procs on. So that wouldn't have gotten an extra bit of damage bonus from using Shenna's Holby, which gives a charge attack and normal attack and plunging damage bonus, but not to burst hits. And just the fact that Frostlight has a really, really good crit rate. A really good crit rate. So it's a bonus 20 crit. For level 2 charge for completely free, nothing. I do find it kind of sad that maybe you get it after you put back all the spirit card. You can find a chunk of rock over here in... Depths is repose that is very clearly meant to fit in that mural over there and that cleft in the rock, but literally does not have. And it actually teleports you here once during the quest line when you interact with it. There's no way to actually return it. Can't actually repair the mural. One of the greatest tragedies of our time. Just go over. I think we can go back and fight the boss one more time now. Two more times and I'll be. More or less good to go? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Let's check this out real quick. This out real quick. Okay. Hmm. Just a second, just a second. This is the team I- No, this is not the team I want to be using. I'm losing it. I'm going absolutely psycho. <laughs> Okay, and he actually kept right because he was on the other team and had his Serpent Spine stacks up. <laughs> Even though we switched to him, since he was still on it, he kept his stacks. That was very, very nice. <clears throat> okay, go for that and keep on going. <clears throat> Here we go one more time. Start off with you and go for another Dredge of Compelia. We're only 10 away from having enough to fully level a character. Should be good. I mean, a maximum of 4 more levels. A maximum of 5 more levels, but probably more like 4. Okay, just like that, and oh goodness. Come on, come on. And just like that. Not gonna go for any normals, we're just gonna go for another plunge, and there we go. Goodbye. Really, really fun team to use, too. But he didn't get quite as much energy back as last time, and this team also works. The only characters I still need more friendship on are Shanyan and Gane. Okay. Three more again. Oh wow. So seven more. So a maximum of four, but probably more like two or three. Yeah, something between two or three. That's actually a really good cryo damage goblet. As long as it's crit damage, it's good on any cryo damaging character. The main thing is just, of course, as you may or may not know, crit rate usually becomes a bit less useful if you're running Blizzard Strayer. Okay. Got a few Shwanwen beasts over there. Let's try to eliminate them. Hi. Hello. Just like that, we can put down Gondi's first, and we got a different view of that because we... Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Mountain Plunge, Plunge Plunge. Hit again and okay, cool. Get, oh, we did not get you. Very narrowly, very narrowly. And as long as we're in the radius, we can actually. This is fine too. I should have swirled already. We've done even more damage that way. Actually, we've probably got a bit of swirl from. Extra damage on the swirl from the quills. Does. Do Shen has icy quills actually apply to swirls? I should check that. I don't know what they would, but I'm not exactly sure that they do. Ideal cryo damage. Mm -hmm. So, with an elemental absorption, they would definitely affect it, but. 
which is the standard elemental reaction. I doubt it would. Okay, well, back over here, it's over on this side, and there is that little, little sort of skin tag on the mound up there, for lack of a better term. I would like to check to make sure that there's nothing really there. Wait, wait, no, this was... The entrance was obscured, so I got a little confused. Let's go up here and... Hello, hello. Hmm. Send me up there, can I? So there is another old smashed stone over there. Interesting. Guess I could try to kill... Another... Pair of goats. Hi. Come on, come on. Oh, goodness, I miss. Come on, can we... Oh, and the goats survived to run away from my arrows another day. Good for them. Somewhat less good for me. Again, not like I really needed the meat. Let's go down here and get on that smash stone, which was hiding away amidst the rocks. And how much more energy down here that I can see and grab right now. Doesn't really seem like it. Hmm. Let's check down here real quick. Oh, it's still going. Okay. Hmm. Oh, but got some poetry. I don't be using the beautiful jade is taboo. Will first be consigned to dust. Hmm. In that case, hmm. let's do a bit more checking. Head back up. Send them most of the way, but not all the way. Come on, come on. Not need to open my inventory. Gotta be kidding me. Gotta be kidding me. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So I've already been in here, already got the treasure. Is that gate over there? And through this. I'm wondering how I can get to the gate slightly to the west of this. It's kind of confusing. So actually using a tar character will work a bit better. But, okay. I was trying to see if there was a illusion or a break of a wall, but it, no. Because Ezra Swami pursued the mountains, not one was harmed by the creature. It fought game, all were saved, Swami's were about, no one knew. Deptus, so big you on. Li was Yong Wong, <clears throat> matched by a Swami, beneficence worthy of remembrance. Talk to you again, I guess. Just fish soup. I did that. I pick you up, and no, okay, nothing really happens. Already got a reward inside here, but wait. If I maybe go up here, oh, there's nothing. There's nothing there. Let's do a bit more checking, maybe. Let's see. Let's try that again. In that case, we're on that side. And this way, there is another one of those gates, but I don't know how to get in. I have no idea how to get in. And run, run, run. Go, 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 die. Die, go. So point blanking it, if and when possible, is going to make sure I can't run too far away. Totally know it. Carry that knowledge with me on any forthcoming goat hunts. Nothing down there? No, doesn't seem like it. Mm -mm. There's another beast. I got... I, Knocked out that beast and got a chest some time ago. So nothing really new there. Let's grab that. Go out and let's grab those eggs. Two eggs never hurt anyone. Maybe the mother bird is a little bit contrite about that. Actually, no, contrition is guilt. If anyone should be contrite, it would be me. But how do I get in here? What do I do? This is more than a little strange. Maybe it's at the end of... But it can't be at the end of getting all the carp, because there's a carp inside there. I want me to consult my encyclopedia. Barrier. Okay. The green barrier shoes on the wall. Let's see real quick. Excuse me. Hmm. Barrier is... How do you do this? Go inside. Is it related to that bead? Let's see. 
Let's see over that way. Green barrier is... Oh, it's actually... So it's Northern Vale associated. Ah, okay. Well, now I know. Cool. In that case, yeah, that's Northern Vale. Technically, you unlock it by going up inside. The sort of mouth of one of the big rings over here, but I don't mind. I really don't mind at this point. Is it cheating? Is it? Who knows? And in the end. Only history will judge me. Come on, come on, come on. Go over and... Wait, is this the right one? Oh, I don't think it is, actually. <clears throat> well, whatever. Can I? I can get up on here this way. This one, I think it is. Just can't see it all that well. Is this... Can I go through this little... Outlet actually can. That was good. Let's climb a bit more and go inside. Around this weirdly mossy rope. That is really cool. I always like when they have macro scale kind of things. The only time I can really recall that they did it was... Well, there was that one big temple over here, but you could argue that it was just big but human-sized. If that makes any sense, but what really comes to mind is over in Sumeru, if you go down to the door to Conria, this spot over here is a door way too big for a human. I wonder what that might have implied about the size of people there. So can I... Oh, interesting. It actually hasn't loaded in the gate. Let's activate this and see what happens when we... Send me inside, or will I fail this challenge? Because the wall is closed. What it might do actually is just put chest on the other side, so now it's loaded in. Something on the other side, but I need to find another way to get in. But I was convinced for so long that it was something about the apples themselves. Oh, so wait. Then what is the does the actual mechanism do? Yeah. Does it activate somehow? Does it just close it early? That is... frankly a little weird. Hmm. Alright. Just gonna go inside. We got a bit of extra clear water jade. One more spirit carp. Nice. Inside this little spot finally. How many carp do we have? We've got... 38, so 12 more. I will get this next patch. And let's just go high up as we can. I'm going down. Oh, we can actually jet some of the way back like this. So how in that case? Let's see. So it activated that, but huh? Yeah, because it's a little video, and what they did was. Jung wall barrier. Uh, they activated something before going inside, but I guess if you go inside the wall, it makes it kind of a moot point. Let's see real, one more time, real quickly. Let's see. So they go down, they interact with that point of light, and they did the investigation point, and it made the wall disappear from a distance. But if you take that teleport gate, it unlocks the wall anyway when you get there. So it literally makes no meaningful difference. That's kind of hilarious. So what's left? Okay, we got that. Custom pin. What do I do? Okay. Some heart-shaped things. Okay. Heart, heart. Back to the boat. Should have... The ice one's free back now. Yep, I do. So after that, I guess I'll maybe put a furnishing through and make sure to collect my realm bounty and the like, but I think that's about it. Got everything on Southern Mountain done, that was more or less what I had in mind. I guess I could try exploring the rest of Chinny Vale this patch, but 
to be frank, it would make it very hard to hit three total hours, which is... You get a few Prima Gem rewards for streaming during these first halves of patches. And the basic target is 30 hours, more or less. If you do that, you get, depending on how many people they've given it out to, around... Let me think. Something around 19, 1800 Prima Gems. Something like that. Either way, I'm in it because they pay me the big bucks. Not. Okay. Let's go over. Georgia Capelli one more time. We'll be jamming. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Just one more time. And Jamie and. Jamie and. Jamie and. Jamie and. We're gonna go for another hydro, jump, plunge, that, that, plunge, and over that, plunge again, and there we go. Simple as, thank you, thank you. Good and manageable. Okay. Resin, spend a bit more resin. Another three. Okay, so. It's two more runs of this, and I'll get everything I need. Period. That, yeah, and it's not an amazing feather. I'm done with that. And, well, if I want to be silly, I've already hit the XP limit. So I'll definitely hit... So I'll be doing this event in a couple of days. I'll definitely be able to hit 50 by the end of the week. I don't need all that much anymore, but it's still good. So in that case, go back to the teapot real quickly. I wonder if anything else comes to mind. What else I could do if... Maybe you could try the Zhao team on a couple of other local legends. That could be fun. So I tried it on the two. Yuji and Tion. Forget. The two Geo Bishop local legends in Chenyu Vale. Okay. Shik schematics, and did I. Okay. Tender countryside. Smart exquisite gen to the extremely commonplace. Truth design, into a temperature, warm and winter, summer, comfort occupants, cedar wood, reliable and affordable, owners need the side environment, easy to modify, all sorts of terrain. Framework are one of its derivatives. Okay. Hmm. Pitched roof. Okay. Okay, let's just make sure I did get everything good. Did I use up my fragile transfer resin? I think I did. I think I did. Should've, should've. Hmm. Yeah. So it's gonna be 12 more spirit card next patch, and I'll be more or less done. Okay. This comes to mind, sure. Uh, two out of three of these areas, 100%. Guess I'll just go over and. Ooh. So Leon's over there. He would actually be a bit better, because if I knock up Rocky, he'll just vanish. If I can keep Liam boys locked, that could be pretty useful. Switch back to the Furina Zhao team. And probably finish things off there. Farzan, Shan Yun, Zhao. Okay. Wakata. Wakata. Zhao has, oh, barely any energy, so I'll need to get that back beforehand. There's some enemies by Liam, so we'll do that. Okay. So if you hit an enemy without a health bar, like a wild animal, with an E skill you won't get anything back. But you can actually, well normally, they can actually, they're actually vulnerable to five procs, weirdly enough. If you use fab on them, and it's a crit hit, you will get energy back. Okay, well, we could hit you. Sure, why not? Goodbye. One more, and... You didn't drop anything then. Oh, you did. Okay, so that's different. You used to drop the items before exploding, but now the items explode out of them. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. Okay, and... Go for a final one, lift. And just explode you, but it takes two to... Cover the pyro or it seems. Okay, cool. 
One more time. For all the marbles. Everybody and over here and come on. And actually knock you up is pretty wild. And how do we do this? Two plunge, one, two, plunge, one, two, plunge, one, two, plunge, two, plunge, one, two, plunge, one, two, plunge. This is not quite as good as the LHP team, but it's not bad. Okay, and how many are we gonna have? Another particle thing. Whoa, who did this? Who did this? Who did this actually? One and. Or, what is that? One, two, three. Does that one hit the others? Let's see. No, oh, actually, it's spam point. It's still probably going to be my best bet. Oh, it hits. Let's see. Depends on how much damage you do. Up in this way. Is someone taking notice of me? I don't know. Come on, come on. Another one. I don't know. Hi. Okay. Not good. That goes away. Cool. And can't have those explorer over the ground hit a thing. Nice. And pretty good. Okay, cool. Yeah. Over a bit more. And yeah, this team is about as good as well. Hopefully, this team is good for guard. It seems. Oh, come on. Plunge, plunge. That plunge is a one shot. Okay. But they don't drop anything. Even though he may fight superficial, superficially similarly to a treasure hoarder potioner, he is an actual one. Kind of similar to how Rocky Ableton is a pugilist, fights like a pugilist, but isn't one. Different model anyway. There's no total identity based on. But, one way or the other. And, uh, jump and jump. Cool. Not bad. Down to heal. And I think that's it for today. I think everyone's probably filtered out by now, but to everyone who watched, thank you. Hey. Well, switch the teams around first. But. Come on, come on. Put back my regular comms team. How much do you have left anyway? We got six, almost at seven, and you're even because I've only ever used you together. In a meaningful Coffee. sense, at least. So that'll be all for today, and a happy Snare Sound Ragon to you.